Hey, how's it going, everybody? Welcome, uh, welcome, welcome to the live stream. Sorry about uh, saying I should have been live a little earlier. I guess I must have misclicked, um, but hopefully no one got too confused and everybody stuck around. How is everybody doing today? Welcome, welcome, welcome. My camera is still messed up from the other day. Let me just change it quick. That should be better. Yeah, there we go. Boom. Nice. Love to see it. Love to see it. How's everybody doing today? Never late. Everyone's simply early. Indeed, sir. Indeed. Uh, when's Life of a Crusader 2.0? Uh, no plans to do a Life of a Crusader at the moment. I'll probably wait until In the Name of Jerusalem comes out and then I'll do it on that, uh, most likely. Um, but yeah, right now, my next Life of a series is going to be Life of a Carthaginian Soldier. And that'll be whenever the Eagle Rising update comes. Um, but welcome everybody. How's it going, Ganesh? Welcome, Jay, uh, Jar. Welcome, Harmon. Good to see you back, um, sir. How's it going, Dan? Welcome, welcome back. Um, how's it going, Sam? SKA. Good to have you here as always. But you got a head off, right? See you later, SKA. I appreciate you stopping by and saying hi. It's always good to have you checking in. How's it going, Will? Mike. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Found your channel a little while, have been been watching your life of a series. You're awesome. I appreciate that, Mike, so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, what series did you like the most? Um, probably Life of a Legionary or Life of a Crusader. Probably one or another, one or one of those, I, I would assume. Though a lot of people do like Life of a Samurai as well, so it's a, it's a nice little mix. Um, but yeah, we're going to be going ahead and diving in and carrying on our campaign. We are pretty close to actually being given our own settlement um in the stormlands which will be nice uh, and then we can really start to take the wars with tywin lannister life of a crusader that was a very good one indeed that was really funny it was just a shame there were so many crashes towards the end um if hopefully you've made it that far um but yeah it was great i was using so i was using like 70 mods in that playthrough though it was kind of in crazy you enjoyed life of a legionary nash yeah that's my most popular one i think it's on like 650,000 views now that's insane and even, even the next couple like the episode two is on like 300,000. episode three is on like 200,000 as well kind of crazy um nice timing just beginning yes indeed zang we are diving in welcome as well dale join the veil yeah, they did, didn't they? The people who were in King's Landing joined up, which was pretty crazy. So let's load in and we'll kind of take a little stock of what uh, what's going on. And then we'll just get started. We'll just dive in. Uh, also, whilst we are loading in as well, I will go ahead and make up a sneak. Get myself nice and ready. If you guys don't know, we are sponsored by Sneak. You can see the little advertisement right there. Uh, sneak are a 0% sugar energy drink. Um, great alternatives to stuff like Monster, Red Bull, ones that have a lot of sugar in and wouldn't really mess you up. Um, Sneak has none of that. It's also only 80p a serving if you get the big tub. So it's a great way of, uh, you know, kind of finding an alternative to something like coffee or, you know, whatever else uh, you want to drink. They have great flavors. I've been drinking it for six, seven months now. Uh, they've been a great sponsor. Uh, and use code JackieFish when you check out. You can also use uh, their uh, their trial as well to see if you even like it before dropping 30, 40 pounds on a tub. And you can get all, ten, or you can get 10 different flavors, one-off flavors and sachets, plus a free shaker cup for all, I think it's like 18 pounds. So it's a great way of seeing if you like the flavors before committing. Uh, as I said, I really recommend uh, you check them out. I'm going to be drinking... Um, some we've got raspberry lemonade today raspberry lemonade which is a really nice flavor especially in carbonated water something that i've recently uh really enjoyed is sticking some of the the, the fizzy ones like this one which obviously isn't fizzy but you still have carbonated water but it is actually a bit more like lemonade really good oh and i also recommend as well you drink it all chilled make sure you have like a very chilled glass of water or cup of water or whatever and you'll be living the dream You'll be living the dream. Yeah, I think it works out as well. With the big tubs, it's like 80p a serving. So it's you know, much cheaper than uh, you know, buying a, a £2 Red Bull or whatever. But yeah, check them out. Use code Jackie Fish, And I appreciate the support. Uh, keep forgetting it's Monday because of a bank holiday. Hell yeah, Sam. Enjoy the bank holidays. <laughs> Enjoy them. 
Glad. How many of you guys are on your bank holiday right now? Or like are off school or off work? Does diplomacy mod work with 1.7.1? I'm pretty sure so because that's what I'm using. So I would assume so. Uh, I can't remember when I downloaded it. I downloaded it probably a while ago. Um, but yeah, I, I assume it does. I'm also using this sick shaker cup as well. I've got some shaker cups I like never use. These ones are really nice. God damn, so many of you guys are off on holiday. Hell yeah. Enjoy it. Enjoy it. Um, cool. So what were we told? Oh, yeah, we were... Wait, have we not already taken Great Wall to Watch by this point? Did we loot? We must have lost it, right? So this is definitely the later save. Uh, we were a simple peasant back then. And we have grown into a man. <laughs> uh, yeah, I mean, I guess this has to be the save. So I guess maybe we must have lost Grey Water. Well, I feel like we had it, though. But maybe not. I don't know. Maybe not. Uh, is this Realm of Thrones? Yes, it is, good sir. Yes, it is. <laughs> oh yeah, we have a little fun poll as well. At the end of the stream, we'll see, uh, we'll see who you guys think would be the best fighter out of everybody. Where if it would be Sir Barristan Selman, Sir Arthur Dane, or Jamie Lannister. And again, these are like peak. These are like peak in their peak, not like one-handed Jamie or old Sir Barristan Selmy. These are like in their prime. Uh, cool. Let's get let's get going. Let's get into some battles. We're currently being chased by an army from the, the Riverlands. There's Ramsay Snow. Oh, if we get Ramsay, we have to execute him as well. I guess we're just sieging? I guess so. Yeah, we must have already fought this because they've got a bunch of wounded soldiers, so... Let's go. We're also making really good money now as well. Uh, yeah, let's, let's dive in. Do we have... Mm, I was just thinking if we had any, like, missiles or anything to, to, to equip. But I think we're fine. But as far as Jackie Fish. <laughs> I wish. I wish. Dane would win hands down. Yeah, he mean at uh, the Tower of Joy, right? He absolutely, he, he was like outnumbered like six to one and he ruined them all. Dane is definitely a, a menace for sure. So is there anyone else like throughout Westeros? Oh God. Oh yes, this map, the laggy map and it's Snowstorm. Brace, bear with us. Um, is there anyone else uh, in Game of Thrones history who could take on so after, like so after Dane? Do you guys think? It was, oh my god, what the fuck hit me? Or a fucking arrow to the foot. What a shot by them defenders. Or do you think Sir Arthur Dane would like wipe the floor of everybody? Because I guess people like Rhaegar, you know, were, were probably weren't like optimal fighters. They had like a goddamn dragon, right? So they didn't need to be a great fighter. Is Sir Arthur Dane like the strongest swordsman in Westeros? I only have javelins, but I guess we can also be on horseback here and maybe try and snipe. Remember, every kill we do get experience, so... Anyone here? They're going to try and shoot me, which is fine. Yeah, we want to try and stay alive for as long as possible. Let's maybe just get these, uh, these things up. I don't think they'll really be able to hit me here. Uh, that guy might... Yeah, let's get these ladders up just as quickly as possible. Ideally, we want to try and get up here as quickly as possible as well. Because there are a lot of kills to be had. The mountain would be would get beat, yeah. I and mean, maybe the mountain was only strong because of his... Uh, well, obviously, he was a skilled fighter. But it was, like, mainly because of his size, right? Can we get inside in time? Like, his size was definitely the determining factor... Oh, I'm going to die. I can already tell. Oh, God. Yeah, fuck. That's so bad of me. You know, like, the mountain was, you know, his size played a role a lot more in his 
capability to fight. Like when he was fighting Oberyn, Oberyn made him look like a child. Like Oberyn was dancing around him. And you would definitely say that that was so bad by me as well. I wanted to try and get up there so I could just hold the stairs and slap, like, slash down, but. That was bad. Yeah, I was trying to get, like, up the stairs as quickly as possible. I just legged it, because if you got up the stairs, you can literally just stand here and just slice them down as they come up. Again, we're talking like a tournament battle, you know, like uh, there's there's an open pen based enclosed. What happened? Just joined. We're basically uh, playing the War of the Five Kings with the Game of Thrones battle lord mod Realm of Thrones. You know what? I'm going to redo this battle quickly. Let's redo it, because I, I was busy reading chat and just doing something stupid. And that's a good opportunity to get a lot of kills. So let's just reload that battle quickly. Yeah, I, mean, I don't think the mountain would stand a chance, right? Again, I'm not, like, fully upgraded on power scaling in Game of Thrones, but, like... Yeah, if, if Oberyn Martell made the mountain look like a child and demolished him, then surely Dane would do the same. Uh, I'm not sure if this mod... Does this mod require open source armory? I can never remember. I can never remember. Okay, cool. Now it's so we just let it lag first. Okay, now we take it seriously, okay? No more messing around. What's the best episode of Game of Thrones? Probably the Red Wedding? Like, I think that episode was really well done. And considering, like, a lot of people didn't know it was coming, it was pretty impressive. I think. Like, it, like again, if you imagine going into it not knowing what was going to happen, I think, I, you know, they did it really well. How did I not hit him? Oh, is he dead already? Are they all dead? Oh. Do uh, Dane used swords, Oberyn used a long spear, Dane would have to get close. True, but you I mean like, Dane clearly has very impressive uh, footwork, right? So it's not like, yeah, I mean, it's all like, you know, who knows? It was never shown in the, in the show. But again, it's not like, yeah, Oberyn did have a long spear, but he still danced around the mountain. It's not like he, uh... Yeah, I don't know. I, I think if if, if if even regardless of the weapon, if Oberyn defeated the mountain, which he did, he just got his head crushed at the end. In all intents and purposes, he did kill him. <laughs> With the poison. And did defeat him if he just... If he just did the killing blow. You, you are friendly, dude. We're still trying to... I think it's now the time to go up. Yeah, let's, let's go up now. We can always just sit there if we need to. <laughs> purple Wedding. Yeah, I mean, they did a great job of a Purple Wedding. Like, if they have all the subtle moments of a Purple Wedding, which I think is really well done. Okay, maybe we don't go up here. Come on, I need the boys to get across. My shield is going to break some. I might have to just jump. I'm going to jump. Thank God he didn't kill me. Get another shield. I think over here is going to be a better chance of getting up. Oh my God, I just killed my own friend of unit. No! Okay. Well, we got one kill. There's no restarting after that. That was just me being stupid.
Ned can easily defeat all three of them with his honor, true. <laughs> yeah, when we have that power scale, Ned lost to uh, Sarpa Dane. Sarpa Dane had him. Just Howland Reed saved his life. Well, yeah, he's defending viciously, but we've broken through the gate now. Also, sorry, Squiddy. I completely blanked. I was in the middle of something and completely just dropped. I'm so sorry, man. Hey, he's almost Squiddy for $20. He says, hey, Jackie, how are you? More Game of Thrones, I see. Lol. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. We're diving back in. I want to try and, like, take King's Landing before we end this series. Um, and put myself upon it. So we can sit on the Iron Throne and not have someone like Jamie rebel against us. Uh, thank you so much, Squiddy. How are you doing today, my man? How are you doing today? Yeah, two kills, I guess. And a little bit of throwing experience, which I, which isn't bad. Cool, cool, cool. I'm pretty sure this is a little bit further back because I felt like we already had it, but I guess not. Also, what the hell happened to the Borrow Town sigil? No idea. Is this a rebellion? Wait, this is ours? Why do we own Borrow Town? And Grey War Watch is immediately under siege. Do they rebel? Oh, they must have rebelled and then joined us. And we crashed. Of course we did. Ah, oh, god damn it. Bloody crashes. When will Game of Thrones not crash? You tell me that. <laughs> Looks like we might be playing that battle again unless it's saved. Hopefully it's saved. <laughs> hey, how's it going, Karma? Welcome. Tyrion with open field, the ultimate killing... Uh, with uh, wildfire, the ultimate killing machine, indeed. There you go, it's saved. Good, good, good. Oh, we've literally just started, Richard, so you haven't missed much at all. Uh, in your experience, Game of Thrones mod, which one have you enjoyed the most? Uh, I think they're both really good in their own rights. You know, it's, they're both, they both really have their, their benefits, they have their negatives, and I enjoy playing both of them. Right now, I would say probably play Troll, so I'd probably say play realm of thrones um for now because trials of the seven is i think waiting on a big update so when that comes out then you can play that one like i think you just play both play this one right now and then play trials when the, the new big update comes out We're definitely getting up there. We need to, we need to change our, our stats as well. Because we're currently getting up. I mean, getting up to the next athleticism might not be bad. Increase your damage. Or with no... Sh yeah, we can get increased damage. Actually, I think we'll stay with athleticism for a bit then. Yeah, well, the new... Uh, the new... Game of Thrones TV show comes out later this year as well, doesn't it? And it's got uh, it's got quite a few good actors in as well, so... We can but hope. We can but hope. I should do a series with more than a thousand, a hundred mods. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I'd probably break the game pretty, uh, pretty quickly. Why are you going this way? Why are you not going through Greywater Watch? Oh, we already lost it to the Dustins. Okay. <laughs> Back to Storm's End we go. Oh my god, there's a big army there though. Be careful. World of Frey is chasing us down. We're chasing World of Frey down now. No, we're traveling back to Storm's End. <laughs> oh, Rob of a Wild Hair. There's some armies around here we need to be careful of. Game crashes like the final season. <laughs> yeah. 
Oh, uh, King's Landing is back in control of King Joffrey, though. And Joffrey has grown up a bit, also. I just need a mod that plays Danger Zone every battle. <laughs> Danger Zone! So I guess we're heading back just to go ahead and replenish our army. How's our army looking? How many good soldiers do we have? So we only have 10 levies. We've actually got a pretty decent army. Nice. I and mean, we have just been in constant war for some time. We've currently got non-aggressions of everybody. We're allied. And we're no longer at war. Robert's clan seemingly has joined us as well in the north. So we, we have a foothold in the north regardless. Gods, gods. There's thugs. Okay. We actually have javelins now. So we'll, we'll be able to do this one, I think, now. My little warband is great. Yeah, my little warband is awesome. Oh, we're on horseback now as well. These uh, these guys do not stand a chance now. There's quite a few of them, though. But we can basically... Oh, I'm going down. Maybe there's no way out of here, right? Yeah. We can finally do this now we're on horseback. <laughs> Come on! Oh my god, imagine if they killed me right now. Oh man, I wish... I wish some... I mean, I know the realistic battle module does, but I wish just vanilla tail worlds would make it so that... Armor was way, way more impactful. Uh, we can dismount now for this. Like, I just wish armor was way more impactful. Like, they hit me with swords and... Like, I'm taking like 30 damage. Yeah, I just wish my armor had played more of a role. Good, yeah. He likes me quite a bit now as well. So, yeah, we should be able to, like, when we do come to forging our own army, I should be able to recruit quite nicely uh, from that guy. And we can play this tournament as well, get some more renowned. Yeah, we've actually got really good armor now, which is super nice. And our one-handed skill's good as well. Yeah, we kick some ass now. This is like where the game becomes really fun because we are just like super strong as a character. I say that, I'm about to get absolutely flattened. Ah, uh, they're ganging up on me! We're ganging up on him now. Okay, we're free to the next round anyway, so it's fine. Our boy's getting back on his horse. Let me on my horse. Let me on my horse. Oh, I'm trying to like slice him off. We can pick up this spear though and deal with him. Once again, Squiddy, thank you so much for the 20, dude. I really appreciate it. There you go. Off the horse, you guys. But yeah, my little warband is great. Also, why do we need these wildling boots? I guess we can make some money. We're making tons of cash now, though. We're a high rank. That's really bad. What? You guys saw that. That, that arrow went through him. Hey, how's it going, Master Beta? <laughs> nice name. How you doing today, dude? Hopefully everyone is enjoying their bank holiday Monday if you're off work. If you're in work and still watching the stream, then I hope you're enjoying that. Oh no, I just shot my own friendly guy. I hope you're enjoying that as well. Look, glad everybody can make it here today. Hopefully it'll be another glorious stream. We're fighting the blue, so we're fighting you. Yeah, like, I, I wish armor really played a bigger part in uh, in combat, you know? Like, I wish, like, heavy armor made me really slow. 
but like it meant I could just tank way more. Like it seems like something they could implement fairly easily into the not fairly easily, but uh, your opinion is Lisa's talking about the oh you guys are <laughs> guys stop arguing about who would win. Let's have friendly debates. Oh I got correct! <laughs> you guys see that? I got didn't know what the hell hit him. Oh, I missed. <laughs> That guy got hit by a crossbow bomb and slashed around the face. You love to see it. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is how you win a tournament. Does anybody play Man of Blade in first person? Uh, I play it now and again, but not regularly. But we can play a couple battles in first person. <laughs> see how we fare. Definitely. Uh, let's have a save here as well. Uh, does it feel weird talking into a camera without people talking back in your uh, to you? Honest, aunt, honest question. Uh, not really. Um, I've been doing, I've been like making YouTube videos for like over eleven years now. Um, so it's really just second nature for me. Like it really is just second nature to, to talk into a camera. And, like, I have you guys talking in the live stream as well. So it's not like I'm not talking, like, I'm no one's talking back to me. Uh, but, yeah, I've been doing YouTube for so long now. It just doesn't really, uh, it doesn't really bother me whatsoever. Like, it's just, yeah, it's just normal. All right, boys, we're about to hit the max rank now as well. We're about to hit rank six, which should be really good. We've got a big old battle, plenty of infantry for us to kill. Um, so, yeah, really just second nature. Because yeah, I've been doing YouTube for like seven years now, maybe. No, seven years, like 11, 12 years now, maybe 12 years. No, like 11 years, just over 11 years, I think. Are you going to have a multiplayer stream soon? Yes, Dan. I wanted to, what I want to do with the multiplayer streams is I'm going to be joining hopefully a clan with some proper clan battles, which will be really fun. So I'll be like, I'll be like fighting in like proper, like proper, like clan battles, like shield rules and stuff like that it's just unfortunately I'm, I'm pretty uh i'm pretty much away the next couple weekends um so and a lot of them are hosted at the weekend so it might be a little while they're planning on having some tuesday events i think as well so i might i might go ahead and join the tuesday events um and i'll stream them obviously but yeah definitely plan Plan to do more. Yeah, he got taken down. Good job. Here they come. Come crossing. We'll go jab them a few of these boys. Obviously, avoid the missiles. It's hard to know who's you're not friendly. Oh, I miss no. It's hard to know who's friendly and who's not. Oh, there you've got javelins as well. Let's fall back a little bit. Is there a Discord server for my community? Yes! Exclamation mark. Um exclamation mark. Uh Discord in the chat and it'll pop up. Oh, I got shot right in the butt. You know, like, I wish I just didn't take half my health in one hit. But I guess they do actually have some decent weapons as well, so. I'm just very cautious about going after the marchers. I'd rather you're friendly. I'd rather stay alive than anything else. Are they fleeing? Okay, we can catch some of them now. Oh, come on. Come back! Let me kill you! I need the experience! Oh, I was planning on getting dismemberment as well for this playthrough. Completely forgot to pick it up in the end. What's left? Some horse archers? No. Cool. Nice. Oh, uh, that? Five kills. Yeah, our two-handed skill is really going up. Again, we're on the lookout for a Warhammer. Uh, Dale, you're proving yourself a fine warrior for your bravery. I've decided to give you a promotion. You can serve as one of my commanders. 
Finally! We can now command soldiers in the midst of battle. You can serve as one of my commanders. You have the privilege of assembling your own retinue of companions and kinsmen while serving under. I will pay for their wages. Hell yeah. And my retinue is... So I can have Sandor Clegane. Uh, and we'll just leave it to the others here. Yeah, you're welcome. So is it just... Yeah, Sandal's coming to join me. So can I just have companions now? Is that it? Okay. Do we have any... Whoa, why did Squiddy get timed out? <laughs> what did you do? You better watch yourself, Squiddy, or else. We'll, we'll go ahead and equip Sandal with some, uh, some decent weapons. What's he got? Arming sword. Sword is better. And boots are better than what he's got. He needs a better chest piece for sure. We give him a horse as well. He can follow me around. <laughs> you better watch it or else. Uh, are we, we're already a Thunder Knight, right? I'm pretty sure. Uh, cool. But we're already there. Now with this tier, it's good. There's no way for us to enter the city still. Like, I wish that was something we could do. I mean, I guess we could leave for a bit. Yeah, we have a lot of Australians. Australia is in my... It was in my top five, but the Australians got kicked out of my top five view, like top viewers, like viewer countries, uh, by Poland. To so shout out to my Polish fans. Poland wasn't a, a, a country I'd expect to be in my top five. It goes like... It goes America, but 23%. Uh, or 20 something ridiculous. Uh, then it goes the UK with like another really high percentage. And then it's like Germany. Uh, yeah, it's like Germany, another European country. Then like Poland, then Australia at the moment. <laughs> yeah, so the Polish beat you guys. For now, anyway. That's like the most recent month, so... But yeah, I definitely would love to, to visit Australia at some point in my life on my way to, to New Zealand. Because I feel like if, you, if you're going to go... Because obviously in the UK, it's like a 30-hour flight or something ridiculous. So if, it was to, if I was going to go there, it would probably be like a Australia, New Zealand. Like I'd go to Australia for like a week and then go to New Zealand for a week type thing. Um... There's another tournament here, which I guess we can do. Again, we might get some better equipment, so. So, yeah, we'll keep on doing these tournaments just so we can maybe get to gain some better equipment. Yeah, I mean, that long sable will be way better than what he has. It's just, it's kind of annoying, but I can't equip. Like, I can't go in and buy stuff. A 1v1. I'm oh, sorry, I'll fight this tournament first person as well. Greetings from Poland. Hell yeah, Shelby. Oh, Kagane's made it through. What happens if Kagane wins? Do I also get his, his equipment? Uh, playing on uh, the Bannerlord difficulty. Um, does it show you? No, I think I have to be out of the... Uh... Oh, God. This is... Uh, fighting it like this is way harder. <laughs> that guy didn't stand a chance. Oh, 
Oh, come on. Uh, I play on the uh, easiest, lowest damage setting or whatever, but I feel embarrassed about it. No, don't be. Like, I think, like, the damage stuff needs to be, like, not addressed. It sounds like it's, like, a, an issue that needs to be sorted out. But, like, it's something that we do need to kind of take a look at. Because, like, heavy armor on the hardest difficulty doesn't do anything. Like, there's no... There's no, like... Difference, like I could be wearing nothing and wearing heavy armor, and the damage is almost identical, which is not how it should be. You know, there should be a big difference between the best armor in the game and the worst armor in the game, and there just isn't really, which is a shame. And like playing or playing on the easier damage section is, is just like I, I like I definitely think that's a very valid playstyle because just having fun, right? And like. It's it's so boring when like a looter two shots you. Like a looter should be not should not be able to two shot you with their weapons. That's just not how it should be, you know. Maybe if they're wielding like a very elite mace or hammer or something, yeah, sure. But they're not. Um, and then playing on the easier damage, like, and again because of that, there's no real difference between like. A, a, a veteran legionary hitting you and a looter hitting you. So playing them easy difficulty is, is like actually fine, I would say. Hey, Jackie, have you played Blood and Smoke at all? No, but I did see it got a recent update, right? Um, so I might take a look at it, do a video on it. Jackie, hear me out. What if every time a Polish fan joined the stream, a winged Tazar started to play? <laughs> That'd be awesome. I listened to, I don't know, it's not, I guess, really that related. Maybe, what was the song called that? I can't remember. I, when, I, when I'm uh, lifting at the gym, I listen to Sabaton. A Sabaton Polish? They have a song called The Wing to Zars, right? Oh, some, uh, some rebels hit us? Yes, by Sabaton. Oh, it is their song? Yeah, I listen to Sabaton. Uh, I, normally, it's like, I think, Stormtroopers. Stormtroopers is an absolute banger. They attack at zero hour with overwhelming firepower. Such a good... They're Swedish. <laughs> it's like me doing, like, a one rep max deadlift, and I'm just listening to that. So we do have Clegane under our command now, which is good. Yeah, we have Clegane under our command. So we at least have someone to follow me. Wait, do we have two? Oh, we do. We have a Bannerman as well. Nice. It's very fun. The only faction to overhaul is Sturgy and the Kuzites, but they fit decently. Nice. Yeah, no, I definitely will take a look at it, Chris. I have been meaning to. Um, it's just getting around to do it. But I am having to... Um, I am having to record a bunch of videos. Oh my, there's so much cavalry here as well. Jesus. I'm having to record a bunch of videos because I'm away this weekend. Uh, so I will probably take a look at it then. Oh, I got sliced. So yeah, I'll probably take a look at it the mod uh, and have the video stockpiled. Yeah, which does mean, guys, no stream this Friday, unfortunately. Well, that's the game right there. Just sliced him. Oh god, I'm so... Oh god. Luckily, their spears are too close. We are. We're getting some decent kills now. This two-handed sword is so good. Jackie, if you like Winter's Ours, you should listen to uh, Hoot Force by Glory Hammer. All right, I'll definitely keep in mind. Maybe remind me in the Discord if you're part of a Discord. Because I won't probably remember that. But yeah, feel free to link it in the Discord and I'll take a listen to some song, song suggestions. Hey, it'd be great if anybody has like a direct link uh, with Sabaton or their record label and you could get me permission to play their songs on stream. That'd be amazing, you know? That'd be great. Like imagine a Bannerlord stream with just Sabaton blasting in, in the background. 
as we like conquer a city. Oh, these. You can tell that this is a dis disorganized rabble. We are cutting them to pieces. So, you know, if out of the 202 people here, if any of you guys are like part of Sabaton or, you know, on their record label, that would be great. <laughs> what part of Australia would I uh, would I go to? I'd probably like the tourist ones like Sydney or Perth or something. You haven't seen Demon Slayer yet, but plan to. Oh yes, Squiddy, definitely start it. Start it right now, dude, and you'll be you'll be watching. You'll you'll meet. Hold on, how do I get to my desktop here? Ugh, I want to like tab out. Give me. Ah, something. Let me go to my desktop. I can't get to my desktop. How do you how do you get to your desktop? It's not just Windows key, right? Is it like Shift Windows key? Look at him run! I mean, no. Either way, you'll meet the legendary the legendary character of Rengoku. Definitely the goat. Still 27 of them left. So it's, it's worth charging in, honestly. It's Windows D, OF4. <laughs> Oh, my horse took a hit there. Tab windows. Oh yeah, there it is. Cool, nice. Yeah, you'll meet you'll meet this bad boy. Ah, oh, messed it up now. Oh no. Oh, my windows just closed. I don't know what happened there. Either way, you'll meet that legendary character, the absolute goat. I'm actually reading the manga right now. I'm catching up on the manga. I've just made it to uh, Mugen Train on the manga. It's like 50 chapters in. Obviously, I'm up to date with the anime, but. And Goku. No, no spoilers in chat as well. If you spoil anything from Demon Slayer, you're going to get banned. You're going to get a perma. Just FYI. Cool. Yeah, another clean battle. I mean, an extra kill. Oh, Clegane got a kill as well. Nice. Good on you, Clegane. We need to get you some better armor. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Uh, Dale, you've served long enough to fulfill your enlistment. Uh, you can honestly retire and keep your gear, but I have needed of talented soldiers. I'll offer you a bonus of 25k. I mean, obviously we re-enlist, right? Because there's only so much... Um, there's only so much until we get our own settlement from him, so... Of course, we'll, we'll re-enlist. I'll take the 25k. That'd be a nice thing to start our kingdom. Oh yeah, someone also asked, are you doing any roleplay or just playing? Uh, yeah, I mean, kind of. We're, we're, we're serving under Renly Baratheon. Um, and we're going to join the Baratheons. We might try and overthrow them and take command of the Westerlands. Um, yeah, we might, we, might, uh, we, yeah we'll, we might try and overthrow Renly and take command. But we'll see. Everyone's just trolling you now, Squiddy. Don't listen to anybody. Everybody's just trolling you. <laughs> you need 20k to get landed? Oh, yeah, you do, don't you, Job? Thank you for reminding me. I mean, we're making 500 gold a day, so... If we go and get some more soldiers, do they stay with us as well? Because I, I can have a retinue. Is retinue only companions, right? It is, right? Did I see the last chapter of One Piece? Yes, I did. I did. I'm up to date. It's so annoying we're on break this week. It's like, why? Why are we on break? One Piece is insane. In the anime and also in the manga right now. The manga is a whole nother level, but the, uh, the anime is getting the rooftop pieces now. Chapter 1000 onwards, and it's just straight fire. And the animation, oh my god, the animation looks insane in One Piece. Uh, oh my god, I get to command an army? Oh yeah, could we just... Yeah, I get to command part of the army now, don't I? Nice. I command the infantry? Why not? Yeah. 
Let's do it, boys. On me. I forgot we get to do this. Who are we fighting? Where are they? Where are they? Oh, they're over here. Sorry, I was looking the wrong way. Let's go, boys. On Life of Legionary, you named your companions after members? Yeah, I'll be doing the same here. I wouldn't recommend subbing for that sole purpose, though, because this isn't going to be a long running series. And like a lot of my Life of the Crusader series stuff, they last like months. Whereas this series, you know, this might be the last episode. Wednesday might be the last episode. So don't like, don't join this with the expectation of like, oh, you're going to be in the series for ages. But I will be doing that again in all my future playthroughs, you know. It's for my shield wall. And just advance, I guess. All right, let's just get yeah, just get him to advance forward. So F4, advance. We'll let, let the infantry lines clash. All about shield wall, boys. All right, now it's time to charge. We'll stay in shield wall, though, to protect us from a lot of big missiles coming in. And obviously look to try and run down as many as possible. Taking a few arrows, but nothing crazy. Yeah, now that we get to command, I'm pretty sure we also get to command soldiers um, from actual, uh, like in actual armies as well. I'm pretty sure we can also command men that way as well, which is nice. So we're going to rack up the experience really quickly now. Like we've kind of like hit critical mass. We've got really good equipment now. We've got good stats. And now it's just all about leveling up so we can get that land. Is it 20,000 experience to get landed? Which does sound like a lot, right? But I doubt it will be. Die that I want to catch. Oh, that guy that fell and I got absolutely demolished. Wrecked. No dismemberment mod? No, I was, I was meaning to download it today. Um, but I just totally forgot. I mean, we could get it. If we crash, I could just grab it next time we crash. Which I guess we'll do. Like, I imagine it will take be pretty quick to install. Is who's friendly here? Well, I don't know who's who. Like who's on my team and who's not. Yeah, you're not. Stole my kill. Um, remember to not pursue too far for large army battles. You're gonna have troops die without reinforcements and be forced to retreat. Remember to not pursue too far on large army battles. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, for sure. Hey, how's it going, Camper? Welcome back, dude. How you been doing? How you been? Been a little while since I've seen you in the chat. You heading out now? All right, see you later, YouTuber. Thanks for stopping by, dude, and talking in chat. Imagine being in... Sorry, we're already... Jackie, do you use the I don't normally do it just solely because a long while ago it did cause a lot of crashes, but I, I know it doesn't. It's pretty stable nowadays. Um, so it's something I do need to grab. Oh, we're in reserve. Nice. Good kill. Yeah, we should have, when we do go independent as well, we should have really good relations with everything here. Uh, hey, Jackie, what do you think about a mod combining castle villages and cities into a province example like Warhammer? Yeah, that'd be pretty interesting. Like, you can kind of get access to everything from one settlement. That'd be kind of interesting, yeah. I'd, I'd definitely be, yeah, see, like to see how it would play out. Hey, how's it going, Joey? Welcome. How you doing? Maybe it is worth asking for leave and going to spend some of this money we have. What do you guys think? Should we ask for like a moment's leave from Rinley so we can go to like Storm's End and buy bu a bunch of stuff? And like upgrade our characters and maybe get some more equipment? Come on. 
like buy some more workshops, maybe get a um a caravan up and running. You're asking Sabaton for me? <laughs> okay. Thank you. The thing is though, most of the time with that like that like with like song copyright, like half the time, like Sabaton be like, yeah, we're cool with it, but their record label's like, no. Who's this absolute loser? Uh, who's trying to play these music? Let's cash in. Uh, Connor, let's not let's not say stuff like that. I don't think it's it's very constructive or it's just toxic. Like you can enjoy Trials of the Seven, and I can enjoy this, and I can enjoy Trials of the Seven, and you can enjoy this. Like there's no need to like. Just, just be negative, dude. At all. Especially when it's like the first thing you say in the chat. Like, nobody needs that, dude. So just chill out and sit back and have positive vibes. Uh, I just watched a guy who played World of Warcraft mod. Yeah, the World of Warcraft mod's really good. It's just got a recent update, uh, which is quite cool. Buy fire pots. Yeah, we'll, we can take a look at them as well. Um, cool. Uh, so let's maybe, um, ask the commander for leave. Um, we've just got a, cool. We just gave him six grand for leave. God damn, that's ridiculous. Uh, okay, cool. Well, let's, let's, let's sort out some equipment. Um, okay. Do you guys have a Warhammer? There's like axes. Oh, they do. They have Robert's Warhammer. Is it two-handed? I feel like it's not very... Uh, it's quite long. It's 20 grand as well. I mean, we'll buy it. We'll buy Robert Raffian's Warhammer, sure. We we'll already have armor. So no need to worry about that. But Clegane does need armor. So let's see what armor we can get Clegane. Yeah, maybe something like that. Got any like Baratheon plate? 39k for the Stormland armor. I'm sorry, sorry, my dude. Um, how do you give companions your gear? Uh, you just select up top here, and you can switch between them, and then you just outfit them like normal. Yeah, I mean, I think you're just gonna be wielding a Gamberson, honestly. Maybe that, because it looks a bit cooler, but it looks weird on you. Um, we're currently paying a lot for this as well. And then maybe better weapons. You're going to be on horseback, right? you got an okay horse. So maybe a spear would be good. Bind pike seems pretty good. Yeah, we'll give him a pike and then I guess a shield as well. Oh, look at that, a Greyjoy shield. God damn, that's expensive. I'll just give him like a knightly uh, kite shield. And there's a harpoon here as well we could give him. So he has spear, but yeah, I think that's fine. Because then we obviously have all our equipment from uh, thingy anyway. Hey, Swedish, how's it going, dude? Welcome. Yeah, we got Robert's, Robert's Warhammer. I think that's fine for now. We could see if there's any more companions to pick up, though. There's some very good companions to pick up. Bron of the Black Water. Some of the faceless men. The Red Priestess. I mean, she'd be a good medic as well. Yeah, let's maybe pick up a few more companions as well. Hodor, Hodor, Hodor. Hodor? Hodor. <laughs> Hodor. How much? 4k? Sure. She'll be a good uh, healer. And we'll, we'll see how much Bron is as well. 4k, sure. Nice. Okay, let's outfit them, and then uh, then we're good to go back. Um, so let's, obviously we'll equip our Warhammer. So we got a Red Priestess. I mean, her armor's actually pretty good. Let's probably give her armor over to Clegane. And then she can just wheel back Gamberson. She should really have, like, red hair, though, right? She's a Priestess. She's going to be my medic, so she doesn't need anything crazy. Sure, we good on her. 
maybe Stannis Baratheon's cape looks dope, even though it's a bit messed up here. How much money? We still have 20k left as well. Cheap padding. She looks like a dress or something, right? As a priestess. Yeah, that's pretty good armor. We'll take that. Um, she has okay boots, right? Daenerys' boots, sure. This is like our budget Daenerys Targaryen. Right here. Uh, and then equipment. She can just like wield like a bow. She can be with my archers. Um, so let's just give her like a ranger bow and some arrows. Yeah, just some barbed arrows. Cool. That's her equipped fully. Well, not fully, but she could obviously do that sure again. Uh, let's do that. There you go. Cool. Then we have Bron of the Blackwater. We have still decent enough money. Looks weird on him. Yeah, he kind of needs his head showing, right? Have some mail over that. That looks cool. I say, I feel like I feel like he is quite like. I feel like his padded gambeson's kind of like what Brom would wear, right? Anyway. Is there any nice watch armors? Yeah, if it's nice watch, watch armors, there's a Night Watch's uh, cloak here you could wear. There's tons of armors in this mod. Not as many as Tri Trials of the Seven do have a lot more armors, uh, for sure. But there are plenty. Give him a horse as well, why not? Because he can be leading the cavalry. And I guess if he's also leading the cavalry, well, there's a Lannister sword there as well. Uh, he should have a spear. So let's just give him a let's just give him a fine pike. Sure, why not? Sword, I'm mean, gonna guess a shield as well. Reinforced kite. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, I think that's all my companions set up. So we've now got a bunch more companions. So gain, gain. I mean he should really have a two-handed sword, but I just don't think I can afford a good two-hander. There yeah, aren't any two-handers, yeah. So I think that's fine. Uh, cool. <laughs> We've got Daenerys Targaryen at home. Daenerys Targaryen at home. And we'll go to our workshop as well. Tons of wine. My god. We've got a lot of wine. Can we sell any of this here? Does it sell for a lot? It's also tons. Jesus, we make a bunch of money here. Um, let's go to our workshop. Let's just try and sell this here. I mean, we're going to absolutely tank the price, but... I mean, it still sells to 32. It's seven grand right there. Boom, and let's buy another workshop. Why not? So we're going to tell this... Uh, yeah, let's buy the silversmith. Why not? 17k, sure. Boom. Okay, so now we need to go buy some, some silver ore. And we need to go buy some wine or some grapes. We can buy the grapes here. Oh, fuck. Go away. Can I just pay you? Yeah. Get out of my face. It's been so long since I've had to worry about these. Um, Let's, uh, yeah, let's buy a bunch of grapes. Oh, it's like no room. Oh, we're so slow. <laughs> I'm just going to TP. <laughs> I can't be bothered to... Uh... Do that. I mean, let's go to our workshop, manage, put all these grapes in there. Perfect. So we can start producing more wine. Uh, and then um, our silver. We're going to want to buy. Do we have any silver here? We have a bit. It's actually pretty cheap, right? It's actually super expensive. Holy crap. So expensive. Yeah, not worth. Um, so we need to go find some then. Where's well, like the nearest silver mine? It's pretty far away. Yeah, probably not worth it. Okay, let's just join. Uh, so actually, wait, no. Let's just let's just let them work independently for now until we have a big enough war party. Uh, so start, yeah, start selling and producing that, and then let's join back. Uh, I have returned, my good friend. And we have all our retinue as well. We don't I need to get them back quickly. Yeah, they need to come join us again. Uh, we also leveled up. Nice. Poem went up. Um, 
Okay, definitely the top one. Hey, Swedish. Thank you, my man. I really appreciate the donation. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And sorry, guys, I completely have uh, been busy. I haven't checked chat in a second. Let me give let me have a, another read. Thank you so much for the $41, Swedish. That's really generous of you, my man. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I really appreciate that. Um, yeah, I really do appreciate that, dude. There's a lot of money to donate. And you donated a bunch last stream as well. So thank you so much for that. Uh, Swedish says, come on, why are we only 190 viewers and only 85 likes? A very good question. A very good question indeed. Make sure you drop a like down below, guys. Or else. Or else Swedish will get you. Um, yeah, so let's do that. Uh, and I'll catch up. Manage my retinue. Like, oh, I need to probably go somewhere, right? Are you guys gonna, yeah, go back to the town. I mean, I can bring you guys in. Join me, boys. Cool. Got my little, my little crew. Uh, the email has been sent. <laughs> uh, Jackie, ever played Nova Asta for Warband? No, one of the mods I never played. Stop winning, Jackie. <laughs> Uh, a small battle. I, I want to kind of. I'll, I'll fight this one. Cause I want to see what my my guys look like as well. So I can just command like one of these battalions, right? And I have all of these following me as well. Riders, Let's just charge. Yeah, go all the boys with me as well. Even though Daenerys will be, or the Red Priestess will be. I didn't equip my Warhammer as well. Uh, that's a bit extreme, wet bread. I would say. A bit extreme, my friend. We are indeed Swedish, but we are, um, we are now independent. Oh, uh, we're not independent. We are now able to command a part of the army, so. As you can tell, we are a lot sh stronger now. I mean, you can command any part of the army. So it makes our life a little bit easier. These looters are hardly worth my time now. They literally give like no experience, but I guess some experience is better than no experience. Uh, how playable is this mod? Definitely playable, um, I would say. There's enough factions everywhere, but you're not going to be having like all the in-depth content that you know you would expect from like a warband mod or something. There are no custom quests. You know, the main things in this mod are like unit trees um, and the custom map and characters. Um, and like the main goal at the moment is just filling out all the unit trees. Uh, and let's also get yeah, quickly. They are all equipped, which is good. Let's make sure that we equip our Warhammer. Uh, we did buy it after all. Uh, I like that helmet a bit more. Uh, and I like these gloves a bit more as well. Okay, well, we now have a big old Warhammer on our back. So we'll see how that uh, that plays out. Are we at war with anybody as well? Out of interest. Uh, which mod has more troop models? Uh, Trials of the Seven is definitely further ahead than this mod. Um, with regards to that. It, it definitely does have a lot more content in Trials of the Seven. But I believe, I believe Trials of the Seven is waiting on their next big update. Uh, it's currently being tested, I think, as we speak. Uh, so that'll be fun when they get their next update released. Yeah, we are making so much money right now. Oh, we probably shouldn't be getting uh, athleticism up. Um, ask for a different assignment. Let's drill the troops. Drill the troops is leadership. And also experience the troops in party. Interesting. This doesn't really help us though, right? Oh no, it levels up the army. Okay, that's actually quite good because it levels up Renly's army. That's actually really nice. Because yeah, it'll level up all of Renly's troops whilst we're dr drilling the troops and also give us leadership. I like that. Cool, I'll take it. 
Uh, yeah, the 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 guy who made um. Yeah, sure, we'll do this one. We haven't missed one in a little while. Uh, the guy who made this mod did say that they're currently working on a bunch of uh, Baratheon armors, which is cool. Yeah, that that's like yeah, like I said, like this is a bit more lightweight, so it does it's like it's not as like intensive on your PC, I would say. Um, so it's a little bit easier to run if you got one of the worst computers. Um, God damn, this guy is wrecking me! Oh my god. I do ten damage to him. God damn it! He's almost killed me as well. Um, yeah, I was like, like, like Realm of the Seven is it? Sorry, Charles of the Seven is a bit more intense on your PC, um, but it comes with a lot more stuff. So, uh, so you have to kind of weigh that up. This mod is a little bit less intensive on your system, uh, and yeah, I, I crashed like once or twice. Nothing crazy. God, come on. And as I said, Trials of the Seven is a big update coming, so I'd say wait for that and just play this whilst uh, whilst you wait, you know. Share the love and play all the awesome mods that people make. Oh, I need a better weapon than this. You're heading out now. I'll see you later, bread. And how's it going, Josh, as well? Welcome, dude. How are you doing today? This guy does not know what hit him. But now I'm a shield. The AI just gets absolutely bulldozed. Oh my god, I got absolutely flattened. Can you take Castle Black? Uh, you can, yeah. No reason not to. I have no plans to go that far north and anger the Night King. We can also go north and actually go fight the Night King now as well. Like, I feel like I have good enough stats that I could probably duel him in a 1v1. That is the weapon I want. Uh, do you know that Warlord Mod is getting a new uh, map update? What do you mean, map update? Yeah. Gonna strike? Die. Stared at me whilst I hit him. Oh, this guy's getting wrecked by me. Didn't even stand a chance, did he? How's it going, Paz, as well? Welcome, dude. You actually got really good leadership. This, this quest does give you really good leadership. It's definitely worth doing.
Nice. Uh, like a custom map, new stuff, as in like a new cut, like a new map that isn't Calradia, or a new map as in like different factions around the map. And um, then the 40k one I know is being for by mod. Yeah, there's a there's a cool 40k mod, uh, the Siege of Rax, uh in development, which is nice. Definitely gonna be interesting. Uh, a leadership went up as well, nice by quite a bit actually. Town garrisons, more security, increased party size. I think party size is going to be the key. Uh, and definitely increase with the same gender. Yeah, there's way more men than there are females in the game. So it makes sense. What do you guys think? Maybe another war with the Lannisters? Lannisters are fighting the Rivellands right now, so maybe it's time to start another war. Oh my god, Sunspear rebelled as well. That's funny. Is Tywin Lannister? Sorry, is Tyrion Lannister a wanderer? Ah, uh, I don't know. Uh, I don't think so. Uh, yeah, no, he is because he's not in this list, right? So if he's not a member of this clan, Tyrion must be a Lannister. Must be a wanderer, yeah. He is a wanderer, so you can get Tyrion. Yeah, I mean, a really good steward. When we start our own kingdom, I guess we'll go get him. Oh, it isn't Cal Radio? Oh, awesome. What, what is the map like? You recruit him in your game? Yeah. I mean, we probably will get him in ours. Because so, so far, we have a couple good characters. So we have a Red Priestess, which can be our medic. Could get like a couple good fighters. Um, Jamie is as well. Could we go get Jamie as well? That'd be nice. A good duelist. Oh my god, Rebels have taken King's Landing. Rebels are so. Uh, oh my god, we need to probably turn that down. There's so many Rebels with a diplomacy mod. Uh, where is it? Chance of. Yeah, let's lower that down. Uh, daily chance to join a rebel faction. I actually kind of like that being high. Like, rebels join a faction. We'll leave that at 25%. Nah, maybe like 10. And we... De like, daily chance to start a rebellion. I guess it adds up, right? Like 1%. To have a rebellion. Reduce it a bit. Yeah, let's do something like that. Yeah, no, he is insane stewardship. So I'm hoping this army will actually get really good. Because we are training the men, like daily experience to troops and parties. So everybody in this army is getting leveled up by just me being here. So I'm hoping this army will be like really good by the time we get into battle. That's awesome, Pigeon. Yeah, no, that's really cool. I love to see it. I mean, that's how that's how a lot of amazing mods and warbands started. Like, the devs just creating their own cool map and design. Um, That's really cool. Look forward to it. Because, yeah, you know, like, like is it per 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 Persian? Persian? Per Persian? That mod for warband has his, all, like, his own custom. Um, What's the really, like, what's the... Best mod for Warband. What's it called? I can't remember what it's called. We played it not so long ago. Um, What is it called? The mod we played not so long ago. Has all the knightly orders and stuff. Like that's obviously custom made and stuff. So yeah, there's some really cool stuff. Prophecy of Pendor. Yes. Yeah, Pendor. Like, that's obviously all, all made up and stuff. So, yeah, you know, like, that stuff you is made pretty awesome. You know, people made that stuff up, so. Okay, is it time for a war, guys? Is it time for a war? Yeah, Pendor is amazing. We, play, we played it... Earlier this, maybe uh, like late last year, 
And we did like an entire week's worth of playthrough, and it was, yeah, it was an awesome mod. What banner mod am I using? Oh, we crashed. What a random crash. I could grab dismemberment really quickly. We could. I also don't want to cause any more crashes. Uh, for anyone interested as well, um, there's my mod list. Let's go back and pause it. Take a look at that. Hey, Monty, six months, man. A half a year anniversary. How's it going, Monty, dude? Welcome, welcome, welcome. I've been a member way longer than three months, more like seven. But don't worry now, Jackie friend, I'm here. Welcome, 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 Monty. How are you doing today? How is uh, the snowstorm cleared up now? Uh, play again. So when is winter coming? Uh, yeah, I mean, uh, we can go north whenever we want to. So right now, the, the goal, the, the plan is to get to, I think the next, I think it's 14,000 experience and then Renly will give me a castle um, and then we'll join him and then we can have like more command, we'll be a landed lord and then we can like have more like dedication in, in the wars to come and then I want to try and like fight some big wars and um, then try and take King's Landing. Um, and uh, yeah, maybe then go beyond the wall with an army. Go kill some whites. Fight the Night King. And save the day. Um, I told me Freya first. No, yeah, six months. At the King tier as well, which is legendary, of course. Thank you so much, Monty. I really appreciate the support. As always, dude. And you are by far. I, I think you're pretty secure on top of your. Uh, oh, oh, we did not mean to do that. How's it going, guys? Welcome to ASMR. Uh, to the uh, top dono of the uh, of the of the month. I think you've got that one secure. Yeah, I think maybe we'll have to start a war. Um, because the AI doesn't really like to declare wars in this, unfortunately. But this is a screenshot of the map thingy. Oh, awesome. I'll take a look at it later on. Bron needs a saddle. Yeah. What's my wallpaper called? Uh, I can't remember. It's on wallpaper engine. I'm sure if you just type in Demon Slayer, you'll, you'll be able to find it. Hey, how's it going, Nick? Welcome, dude. JK Post, yeah, sorry, Robert, already. Hey, Nick, coming in with the two months as well. I appreciate that. Hell yeah, dude. Thank you for returning. I really appreciate it. It's always great seeing uh, members coming back for multiple months and at the king level as well. You're a monster, dude. Thank you, thank you, thank you, dude. I really appreciate that. And your flag is no longer tattered. You've got, got a nice little flag on the, on the go right there. Uh, cool. So I guess we're gonna go to war. I guess maybe we go to war with the Lannisters again, because they're busy fighting the Riverlands. So let's uh, so let's campaign. Uh, declare, declare war. Yeah, declare war. Westerlands, and then what are we Stormlands? What are we? Is a fat? What's our faction called? Stormlands? No. Oh. Yeah, what are we? Uh, we are... Did I spell it wrong? Oh, Stromlands. We're not the Stromlands. <laughs> We're the Stormlands. Uh, Stormlands. Boom. Cool. We're at war again, guys. Let's see how Renly performs. The war, the army is forming. You heading out now, Squiddy? All right, good night, guys. As much as I would love to fall asleep to the stream. <laughs> See you later, Squiddy, man. Thank you so much for the $20 donation earlier. I really appreciate that, dude. Have a good uh, have a good rest of your week. I'll see you in the next one, dude. Oh, we're in this army. Good. That's nice, nice. 
We're currently heading to Duskendale, which is actually part of the uh, Lannisters. Nice. Yeah, have a good, good rest of your week, dude. Time to get beaten by the Lannisters again. Well, hopefully they're very busy fighting the Riverlands and we'll be able to, to hit them down a notch. I mean, I say that, but it seems like the Lannisters are under siege pretty heavily. But hey, a big battle. I mean, we got we got two fairly large armies, like 1,700 man and a 1,200. Like, we have rallied the boys. So it's not like we're we're rocking with nothing. I should also declare war on King's Landing rebels as well whilst we're here. We'll make our play. No spaces, right? Yeah, no spaces. Rebels. Does that work? Not found. Do you think maybe it just doesn't have the apostrophes and just the S's, probably? Not found. What's their faction called? Is it just like King's Landing? King's Landing Rebels? I don't know. We'll just rock with it, whatever. Oh, the army broke. How annoying. Oh, uh, yeah, sorry. So, right, cool. Sorry. Yep, yep, yep. Did I? Oh, yeah. I, I loaded the wrong one. You're right. Ah, pause it. Ah, no. Ah, pause. Cool. Yeah, sorry, I was loading the wrong one. Uh, so, campaign. Dot. Declare war. Um, Stormlands. I mean, I guess it's king. I assume maybe the apostrophes are there. Landings. Rebels. No spaces, though. Cool. Thank you. Sorry. It's because that's how I did hype it, and we're going. We're going to go making our play. We're going for Storm's Landing. Storm Landing. That's what I'm going to rename it to. <laughs> so like, I didn't look like a fool, and we're just going in for it. My God! All right, the Siege of King's Landing. Here we go. They have 500 defenders. The Iron Throne will be ours. Your special edition leather books are coming? Hell yeah. Hopefully the roads will stay good. Well, yeah, hopefully. Hopefully. Um, and I get, I get to command the archers? Hey, what's happened? No! The game hasn't crashed. It's just loading? Oh no. Can't click on anything. The game hasn't crashed though. The game is 100%ing my CPU. Hold. Give it a moment. Maybe it'll just load. Maybe it's a loading thing. Hold. Hold. If not, I'm pretty sure we saved it not so long ago. Now we have the size of the battle. Yeah, maybe. Ah, uh, so this is uh, this is vanilla now. This is actually in the game as a feature. How did you get Serve as a Soldier to work? You need to download the 22nd of November version. If you go to my top 5 mod video I did recently, uh, I explain it there. Uh, we'll give it... Yeah, I mean, it's still maxing out my CPU. I mean, I just assume the game has, like, crashed. 
Where are my dragons? Where are my dragons? It's fine. We'll just reload quickly. And again, if it does do that, like, all the time, then we can just sort it out at some point. Cool. We'll just reload. Dive back into it. I'm pretty sure we saved uh, right away, so... The game is telling me I'm not ready to become king. <laughs> Will Man Blade come to PS4? I imagine one day, yeah. Probably after the release. Um, probably after the full release. The console version will probably be later. Like six, seven months later. I would assume. All right, cool. Have I already have I declared the wars yet? Or is this before that? Before that, cool. So, we want to do camp, and I'll make sure I save it this time as well. Campaign, declare. Stormlands. Westerlands. Let me go campaign. Declare war. Stormlands, uh, what is it? King's Land, no. King's Landing Rebels. Cool. Oh, is it not found? I put Stormlands again. Actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to drop a save here. Uh, and then we'll do this again, and I just won't put Stromlands. <laughs> the classic Stromlands. Cool. Uh, when will Battlelord come to console? Yeah, I would imagine it would come to console just after the release of uh, when the game comes out of early access, I would assume. Oh my god, there's a lot of uh, enemy armies roaming around here. There's also a Reach army here as well. Oh, what the hell is this? Sorry, what is this event? I've, is this a serve as a soldier event? I've never seen this. I've literally never seen this event before. Is this a, a serve as a soldier event? So we basically just killed a, a family whilst we were looting the village. And we've suddenly heard the sounds of cries and screaming catching your attention. Someone's still inside. As you go in and investigate, you quickly find the source of the noise. It's a child, barely older than an infant. The soldiers that came by earlier either didn't notice or didn't have the heart to kill the child. You realize that w uh, with all the village driven away, it might be days or even weeks beyond anyone return and you're not sure what will happen to the child. The of the soldier. Yeah, we'll take the child. It'll be like, uh, it'll be like Thorfinn in, uh, in Vinland Saga. I'll train him to be my own. So, yeah, look at that. Good old Tracy. Okay, what should we name the child? I'll let Monty decide the child. Um, as he is our top donator of the month. Hey, how's it going, Victor? Not well? Oh, uh, dude, hopefully, uh, hopefully it turns around, man. All the best. Hopefully, uh, yeah, hopefully things look up, dude. I'm sending you all my positive energy. Hey, how's it going, Elvis, as well? Welcome. Name it Jackie Long Stroke Fish. <laughs> a perfect name for a perfect child. Uh, I don't need to be in part of these battles. Not worth my time. Yeah, just finish them off. Send the troops, boys. 
right away. Yeah, I mean, we're making a lot of money. Our workshop's making us a lot of money as well. Yeah, well we are we are butchering the, uh, the lands here. Hopefully, we'll join an army. It seems like King's Landing is already under siege, which is fine. Wait, are we at war with... Oh my god, we're at war with the Reach now as well. The Reach declared war on us. Oh, this is a true war of the Five Kings. But I don't like the idea... And we can fight this one. I don't like the idea of being in this many wars. Oh, come on, the infantry. Get into shield wall. Wait, no. Don't follow me. Go there and get into shield wall, please. Oh, we have the big old... We have Robert Baratheon's Warhammer as well. I want to see how much damage this bad boy does. Get your get your asses up here. Uh, why is it when you guys say stupid stuff, he reads it, but when I have a legitimate question, I overlooked it? Unbelievable. <laughs> Ask your question again, dude, and I'll, I'll, I'll try and answer it to the best of my ability. Are they coming around, or am I just going to literally just sit back? Okay, let's push up then. Oh, the cavalry's already going in, so we should just charge. Oh my god, look at the Reachmen! Oh, that's awesome! I haven't seen like any of the Reach's units, so it'll be fun to uh yeah, to fight the Reach, I think. I'm just time to charge now, boys. Give them hell. Let's see. Oh my god, look up! Our guy's going flying! Oh my god, his weapon does so much damage. Oh my god, his weapon does so much damage. Gods, I was strong. Come back here. <laughs> can almost feel bad using it, you know? Especially this poor unarmored guy. I missed as well. 200 damage in my back. Oh, we have to go and carve the Night King in two with this weapon. When we go independent, we have to go and mess up the Night King. Yeah, I forgot we were in a war of a reach, honestly. But I need to be careful, though. Like, very careful. And yeah, we got a proper battle, okay? A proper battle against the Reach. Yeah, as I said, I guess we'll command the infantry. Because the infantry kind of play off. They attacked us as well, right? So I guess we want to move into the town. Into the village. It means our archers won't be as effective, but... Yeah, they have, they have way more archers than we do. So yeah, let's form it like here. We'll get into a shield wall. And the guy said, didn't even ask a question after I said ask a question. Yeah, they attacked me, right? So if we can get like up close and personal here, like get them in a really bad position and we can just like come running around the corner at them. But also might not be a bad idea just to really get in their face like right away. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Is he stuck? Come back here. Oh, God. Yeah, like, getting on this hill could be a good idea when we just come crashing down on their archers. Get him, boys. How you... Yeah, finally he's dead. Yeah, their archers are right here. Go, go, go. We probably, we probably need to form shield wall, but... Shield will push. We're going to go flying into their... Oh, they're already running away. Not good. Hey, we fought... Oh, we got people behind us. This is so bad. This is so bad. We got people... Okay, break. Sorry, no. Charge and break shield wall. We need to go behind us, and hopefully we can avoid their archers hitting us in the back, which I highly doubt is going to be something we can do. Let's 
like proper knights as well. Look at that. And then whip out the Warhammer. See how you like the taste of my Warhammer, boy. And we want to get back up here as well. Like, avoid the archers at all costs. Oh my god, so much damage. 200 mount damage is just insane. Yeah, get back up here. They still have their cavalry left, but... Should be fine. So they have all them archers left now. Form your shield. Where are our archers? Our archers are way back there. Okay. Form that shield wall. Should be able to repel most of their cavalry. And we just have to wait for them. Should get their archers. Their archers are getting really close as well. So I'm hoping we can get like here and we get like way too close and we just charge them. Bloody sex bots, man. Just leave us alone. Let us enjoy our life. How close? The archers are still like really far away. Um, hide user on channel. Oh. He can one less reach knight to worry about. Be gone, bot. Yeah, literally. Okay, the archers are being pushed up now, which is good. Our shield wall is decent. I kind of want them to get closer, though. We'll wait and see what they do. I mean, we pretty much killed over our... Yeah, they're way closer now. Keep on it. And then we get closer. They shouldn't be able to see us too effectively. Our own archers are being pushed up now as well, right? Yeah, got cavalry on that flank. Okay, there we go now, I think. <laughs> You're about to do it with the bot. Hell yeah. Sorry I cucked you. Hey, Lancelot. How's it going, my man? Welcome back. Good to have you here. Another, that's your third re-king membership, like, this, uh, this stream, which is goddamn dope. Oh, you guys aren't. Yeah, get back and shield them, please. Advance forward on them. Come on, boys, get closer. Ready to break formation. We're going to absolutely decimate them, okay? Zarge line is very scary. Push, push, push. And can I get these guys to advance? Does that sort them out? Yeah, advance on the enemy line. Well, I don't have the... Okay, now break and just charge. I don't have like a... Give me... Yeah, that's what I want. Well, it was a pretty hard battle just because of like the terrain and the, the type. They didn't really have any infantry, but they had tons of archers. Thank you so much, Lars. Like over 10 months, dude. Almost our year-long anniversary. That is awesome. Really appreciate it. Hey, Jackie, just popping in to say hi. Hope you're doing well. I'm doing great. Thank you, my man. Hopefully, you're doing well as well. And welcome, Blast. How's it going, dude? Uh, have I read the A Song of Ice and Fire books? I've read up to the fifth one. I didn't really read the last two. I kind of, like, skimmed them. Um, last one, last two, yeah. Um, there's a few, uh, like, there's a few I, I, I just skimmed through. Because I, like, already knew what happened, so I was like, ah, just kind of read chapters. Uh, nice, we captured Samuel Tarly in his Targaryen armor. Can we convince him to join us? No, he doesn't want to, coward. Well, that's one army destroyed. We need to get out of here, by Renly. Yeah, Renly, run. Get out of here and join an army or something, my man. Oh, did someone take King's Landing? Oh, we took King's Landing. Huzzah! And it was given to the Selmies. The Selmie clan. Who the hell are you? Yeah, I have no idea who you are, but welcome, I guess.
Uh, yeah, I mean, we, we're doing looking pretty good. We're almost at the next tier. 2,000 more experience, which shouldn't be too hard to get. We're recruiting, but we should be leveling very quickly. Our leadership is pumping up. Nice, nice, nice. Is Sebastian Selmy's father? We're now... I guess Sebastian is defending... Defending to the last. Why the hell are we just raiding villages as well? Oh, we are so... Ah! Okay, another very good battle. Let's go. A 200 versus 200 man battle. And come on, guys. We can easily get to... Let's, let's say 180 likes and we'll fight this battle, okay? 180 likes. If you haven't dropped the like button, make sure you go ahead and hit it. There's over 220 of you guys in the chat and 140 likes. We can easily smash that. Go ahead and hit that, that like button right away. Sam should be have a nice watch. Yeah, I mean, I don't know why he's down here. Obviously on a mission to do something. We're, we're fighting Samwell's, uh, Samwell's sister now, I assume. And a red wine. Oh my god, the likes got up so much when I blackmail you guys. How about you just fight it anyway, because it's what we demand of you? No, we're going to stay here until we hit 180 likes. I refuse. I refuse. Yeah, no, of course. Oh yeah, let's also listen to the, um, this soundtrack. The Frostpong soundtrack was really good. Yeah, cool, let's just fight it. <laughs> let's go. There's going to be a close battle as well. Uh, so, okay. So, what do we want to command here? Probably the infantry again, I guess. I feel like we just have the most success with the infantry. Let's do it. Yeah, the Frostpunk soundtrack is actually really good. And what do they have? So, they have 80 infantry, 70 archers. We have more archers. So I guess we will try and like have a little bit of a range off with them. We are defending. So what happens if we just form up? Also, our army is looking pretty elite as well. Yeah, if we just, they're attacking us, right? So I'm going to set the infantry and shield. We'll let just sit there. And then we're going to go off and try and kill some of their uh, their horses. Oh my god. <laughs> we'll use a two-handed sword. Crossbow's doing good. There are a lot of Azurai units in the Red Wine army. They're basically sitting ducks for our crossbows right now. Yeah, it seems like we've kind of done a pretty good job at cutting down their lines. They still have so much cavalry, though. My God. Yeah, they still have, what, 50 horses? We have, yeah, not as much. Push forward the infantry line a little bit, I guess. Let's try and thin out this uh, cavalry fight. Oh, God damn. Hit a horse. Oh, come on. We need to definitely cut down the amount of soldiers. They have so many knights. They're very shiny as well. God, I'm just swinging mindlessly right now. I'll split your skull. I'll split your skull, mate. Even just mounting was not a bad plan of action. Uh, Renly Baratheon is telling me to hold the high ground. Let's pull out the hammer. Oh my god, this weapon does so much damage. It doesn't have like the longest range, but yeah, if it hits, it basically one shots. Even if he like partially hits, it's still one shot. So that is filthy. Okay, we're losing knights, but we're still killing. So I guess it's good. Oh, over his head. <laughs> this weapon is just ridiculous. It really is. How's the energy lines? Just holding. Good, good, good.
Hello, boys. You any of you guys trying to come and get me? How's the uh, main infantry fight going? Uh, we're taking some DZF. They just have so many cavalry. They have so much horse. Brutal. Let's get a little bit closer. Push up a bit. At least this is really good experience for our serve as a soldier, though. Because these are all, like, tier 6 units. Like, these are these mm, breachmen are, you know, decent units, so... Every kill we get on them is uh, valuable, to say the least. After this guy now. Another one bites the dust. Oh, another one down. Yeah, I mean, our shield wall is holding. I mean, we have a lot of arrows in our shield wall. I guess we'll slowly push forward now as well. Their cavalry advantage has definitely been diminished. St it's still there, but definitely less than it was. Come on, bring him down. Are we doing okay with a missile off? I think we are, right? Like most of our archers, instead of firing forward at their lines, they're like uh, are like heavily focusing on the uh, on the cavalry. Yeah, our shield walls are gonna break soon as well. Sorry, let me catch up on chat as well quickly. But, uh, we are losing men now. We might just have to, like, really close in. Uh, by the way, Jackie, if, I don't know, you asked what everyone wants to see, and in my opinion, I'm just console player, but I love big battles, and the commander has spelled that wrong. I just want to see you have fun. I appreciate that, Lancelot. We all pray for the day you get smacked by Jackie's hammer. Uh, are you heading out now, Robin? All right, see you later. I appreciate you saying bye, dude. Sorry, I couldn't maybe cat. I think I missed a bunch of your messages. So I apologize for that. Um, it's over, Reachman. I have the high ground. It's possible to combine the mod with other mods, like longer sieges and new arenas. I don't see why not, Camille. Uh, maybe new arenas could mess it up, uh, but I don't see why. I mean, try it, right? The only mods that shouldn't probably work with this is ones that directly affect the affect like the settlements, which I don't think any of them mods do. So you should be good. Uh, should I download Realm of Thrones or Trials of the Seven? Um, I don't know. It's really up to you. I know Trials of the Seven has a big update on its way. Um, it's in the like, development, so maybe hold off until that releases. I, I maybe. Again, it's completely up to you. But what I'm doing is I'm playing this whilst I wait for the Trials of the Seven update, I and mean, then I'm gonna give that a go, another go. Uh, let's advance. Let's just push on them. Why not? Let's just tell the infantry. Uh, to add advance. God, so much. Yeah, we are getting... This is, this is hard. They have so many archers. I don't really know how they have so many archers. I missed them on. We have... We still have more infantry, but we are losing infantry. Our archers are on top of the hill now. I mean, hopefully our archers can start doing some damage. I mean, we only have 40 of them left. Yeah, a lot of them are out of ammo as well. Our shield wall is getting peppered. Maybe I can help out a bit. We have a lot of scary soldiers back there. Yeah, this Reachman army is uh, is pretty deadly. Hey boys, charge. Oh boys. Yeah, I'm not. Oh, we have to dismount and just go go to ham, pull out the hammer. It's hammer time, boys. 
Ouch. The arrows. No, no, I can't die. If I die, it's over. If I die, it's literally over. I need to pull out that shield. We are still in shield wall. Yeah, we just have no way of really dealing with their... Uh, we, like, we won the infantry fight. Remember, our archers just causes a big pain in the ass. That's their lord? Yes, we killed their general at least. I mean, we are killing. They're running? They're running. Okay, they're running. We just have to push on their archers now, okay? Reform, and we need to push on their archers. They can't have much ammunition left. Okay, their front line is running. Their lords are dying. Good, good, good. Um, yeah, reform the shield wall. Reform! Reform the line! Reform! We need to kill that guy quickly. Nice. And then advance. Okay, they're like getting close to us now. I uh, just charge. Are oh, you guys not in shield war anymore? What the hell? I'm scared of like a rogue arrow. These guys don't have weapons. Okay, well, that's a twofer. This Warhammer tears them apart, man. Uh, we got 25 kills this battle. Uh, I mean, they still have plenty. The band's power is still not that badly against him. Kill him. Oh, I missed him. Why was I not in shield wall there as well? I must have broken it. Kill that guy. Nice. Another red wine dead. Kill the horseman. Oh, he got me. He got me. Yes, bring him down. Finish him. Cave in his chest. Another one coming. Here they come. Nice, got his horse and got him off his horse. 26 kills this battle. Yeah, I mean, the army is going to be brutal. Like, it's, we lost 104 brave men this day. Oh, get him. Get him. Are you running? Yeah, get out of here. Get out of my face. Uh, they charge as you move forward. Look at me as well. I am battered by arrows. If I die, it's over. That was a good battle. Four renowned as well. Good, good, good. Yeah, I got 26 kills for that. Brutal. I'll take it. Shields covered in arrows. Yeah, that was a brutal one. Okay, we need to run home now, okay? Yeah, we literally got like a thousand experience in that battle. We're we just so wounded. Yeah, I think we're just wounded. Run. Flee to dawn. Oh, we actually own this as well? Oh, the Selmy's own this. Nice. Crude some soldiers as well. I'll take it. Okay, we're heading back to the Stormlands now. I guess we have to recruit and you know, obviously lick our wounds. But the good thing is as well, like I'm constantly training the, the soldiers in my army, which is nice. Some poacher scum. Okay. How do you speed up the timer in battle? Uh, yeah, RTS camera. Again, check out my most recent video. Oh, I for totally forgot to command anything. My bad. Uh, check out my my one of my more recent videos, the top five mods. I show you guys exactly how to get RTS camera to work. Yeah, hopefully that'll make a name for ourselves, Monty. Because that's some good renown, lots of experience. So, oh god, there's a lot of them. Oh my god, this water is brutal. Okay, it takes seventy five damage. It's hammer time. My god, I'm doing 300 damage to these poachers. <laughs> That's insane. This weapon is crazy. No wonder Rhaegar's chest exploded. Oh, my horse is so almost dead as well. Don't mind me. 
<laughs> Time behind me. Okay, Cavalry's coming in now. The old joint attack. Oh, nice. Our renowned went up as well. Awesome. So we are now already clan rank two, which is great. Because when we leave, we can have like 120 men. Cool. Another 10 kills to add to Vitaly. And we can also now level up our two-handed again. Uh, so increase your damage of two-handed weapons by 20% when less than half hit points. Garrison wages are reduced. Increase your damage when above. Uh, yeah, probably above. Because, like, if I do get hit, I end up taking a lot of damage. So I'd rather just have the HP, I think. Oh, there's more poachers. Uh, we don't get to command anything here, I guess. Not that we need more damage of two-handed weapons, honestly. Oh, I missed. Awkward. I missed my gouge lance. Oh my god, someone. There we go. Oh no. I mean, the good thing is they're shooting me instead of... It's hammer time! Okay, it'd be good if I actually killed someone, okay? All this damage is great, but I do need kills. And then back we go. Oh, my horse is so dead. I am so dead. Okay, we can't do that again. We're almost dead and so is the horse, so let's just fall back. Uh, I'm mad with all the work we did. I'm back uh, being a crash simulator. Yeah, I think that's the problem, Monty, with like Carrier Expanded. It's because it's in, like n like it's not properly out yet. You're going to be having problems like that. It's like one random crash that needs to be fixed is going to take ages to be fixed. But uh, yeah, it's super annoying. I definitely feel you. You're probably better off just not using Carradio Expanded until they can fix all the bugs. Uh, yeah, Danny, if you have RTS camera installed, press L and you'll be able to... You're, you need to press L when you're in battle and you can config keys and then you can speed things up and adjust what the speed is uh, here as well. Cleaning up some poachers. Oh, nice. We're so almost at my next rank as well. What happens when we hit the tier 7? Do we, is this tier 7 when we get given a castle? Or is it 20,000? Dale, you proved yourself you're fine. Worry, your lord, you have decided to give you a promotion. Visit my blacksmith. And I don't think there's any other, any other thing we can have, right? Like, what is tier 7? I don't think anything here is tier 7, right? Yeah, it's still the Thunder Cavalry. Maybe just get paid more, I guess. Uh, yeah, we'll give... No, I mean, that looks kind of stupid on Bronn. Bronn's like a main character, so he needs the helmet. We want the greener patches now. <laughs> I know exactly what you mean. Okay, we're going after Ashford, which will be a nice little conquest. Now, now we're going into Bitterbridge. I mean, you got enough men. But each of us, you have a lot of soldiers as well, but... Yeah, I think we'll be getting into a big old battle soon enough. Did Robert ever wear a helmet? I mean, you can't wear a helmet if you're a main character, right? Gotta be able to see your face. Okay, another siege battle. Taking bitter bridge this time. 
Is it still like um? Is it still twenty thousand experience to be given a, a settlement or what? Is it twenty thousand or is it like any chart any point above fourteen thousand? Okay, we just need a bridge to be pushed up, right? There's also a way you can actually jump your way into the settlement, I think, as well. We each have a lot of boom. Oh my god. Yeah, you can actually like cheat your way up here, which is quite funny. Maybe not there. A very secure castle. God damn it! And now we're playing a Sandok again. Because I died. Get these bad boy ladders up. Let's see what Clegane... Oh, there's a lot of them there. Maybe not. Because let's see what Clegane's made of, but there's a lot of infantry there. You're watching whilst I'm a rowing machine? Hell yeah, dude. That's awesome. You have to speed up every uh, every time I die in battle. You have to speed up. <laughs> One of the really fun, like, hit type things I did when I was, uh, when I used to row quite a bit was I used to love to do, it was like, it was blocks of like, so you do, oh, what was it? Yeah, you, you do 100, you 100 meters stop for 30 or stop for 30 seconds or a minute. I can't remember what I did. It was like 100 meters stop, 200 meters stop, 300 meters stop, 400 meters stop, 500 meters stop. And then like with the same rest period in between. And then you'd go down. So then you'd go 500, 400, 300, 200, 100. That was, uh, yeah, that one was pretty intense. Hey, how's it going? Very welcome. Let's see if we can go up now. I should have just waited, honestly. I was way too greedy. Yeah, <laughs> uh, surprise. But one weakness. It's like I'm in Edinburgh Castle. There's any rocks up here. Okay. However, I could pick up this javelin and suck it. Oh, I'd love that axe, honestly. Yeah, we should give Clegane like a big two-handed axe if we can get our hands on one. Back down we go. Or even just like a two-handed sword, I think would be great on him. Is it, is it, this is a two-handed sword, right? Maybe not. Yeah, I mean, the settlement is very much taken now. We already stormed the gate as well. Uh, bro, is Nexus Mod safe and can I delete it? Yeah, I've had no problems with Nexus Mods and I've been using it since the game came out. Uh, but you don't need to pay for it or anything. Just get a free, uh, a free mod. And I also recommend not using their mod launcher. Just install them manually. It's so much easier. Um, if you want to, if you want to find out how to install mods, check out my top five mod video I did recently. Uh, it's on the channel. I run through how to install a bunch of mods and you can just basically rinse and repeat that for everything else. It's really easy. I avoid using the uh, I avoid using the, the Nexus mod launcher just because it, it it just does it creates more problems than it solves. I think. <laughs> Don't ever say I could pick up a javelin and suck it again. Why not? Make me, Monty. <laughs> you can't tell me what to do. Nice, we leveled up again as well. Perfect. Uh, let's get another point in leadership, of course. 
Hey, I mean, we're, uh, we just taken, what a random castle. Oh, we crashed. God damn it. Might have to buy that one again. Crashes be crashing. God, it's going to be so nice when Battle Lord releases and, like, after the first initial patches of, like, stability and stuff, we don't get, like, a major patch for, like, two, three months. And all the mods can just, like, just, like, work and be stable. That's the dream, man. That's the dream. Dude, I was so good at rowing, but Harvard offered me a scholarship. Hell yeah. Uh, yeah, I guess we'll just... We go again. <laughs> uh, it's crashing. Maybe conflicts one of your other mods. Oh, uh, yeah. I mean, we just crash every so often. It's pretty common. Pretty common. Okay, this time we're going to wait for a while. Okay, we're not going to go charging in. We're going to just chill. Do nothing crazy. We're just going to sit here, hang out, try and parkour our way up. We'll let the arrows fly in and then we're going to jump in. Don't you dare tell me we crashed again. No! Why? We are plagued this day. Sometimes it just be like that, though. Sometimes it do just be like that. Leaking my needs. Enhance. Enhance. Uh, Jackie, your wish of the moon with wanting mods just to work, yeah. True that. True that, John. I can't join any clan. I play as the Northman in the game, but Ned Stark keeps telling me I have to prove myself. Uh, yeah, if you want to join people, you have to be clan rank two. If you want to if you want to fight as a soldier in their army, you have to have serve as a soldier of a mod. Do I have a shader mod? That's probably doing it. Uh, no, I don't. Again, it's just like random crashes you get, and it's just unfortunate we're getting them all together. It's nothing crazy. It's just how it be with Bannerlord. It's just how it be. Also, me like sprinting around on three times speed probably isn't great for the game, you know? You know, me doing this probably isn't great for stopping the game from crashing. Uh, where do you get my wallpaper from? Uh, I just use a program called Wallpaper Engine. It's like four pounds on Steam. And you get access to... God damn it! Uh, yeah, I just use a program called Wallpaper Engine. Okay. Sorry. My bad. Again. Me saying I probably shouldn't be doing this. And then the game proceeds to crash. Don't worry. <laughs> it's fine. And also, like, you can just, like, not fight this battle as well, you know? If, if this, like, continues to crash, we can just not fight the battle. I can just wait in reserve and let them fight it. And then we move on. So it's all good. Okay, no triple speeding, no doing anything crazy. 
Oh, but it's so tempting to triple speed right now. It's so tempting. Like, just imagine we're playing vanilla and we don't have access to triple speed, okay? Maybe I can get on the artillery piece. Man on my way. Get on my way. I need to get on my trebuchet. Okay, we'll just we'll just skip this battle. It seemingly is broken for whatever reason. It's all good. We'll just skip it. I just won't fight it. It worked the first time though, which is weird. I <laughs> resist. Use the force. Uh, yeah, let's just let's just load and then. We'll just wait in reserves, let the men get stuck in. We'll probably take more casualties, but... Um, you're French, and you've been following the channel for about two years. Awesome, man. I appreciate it. Thank you for the support. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm glad you enjoy the content. Oh, uh, yeah, we'll just wait in reserve. All these way more men than I win if we fight it. We might not even win, honestly. We're literally not going to win if I don't fight. Yeah, okay. Well, we got this battle instead. <laughs> We got a massive battle instead. Okay, guys, let's, let's get 210 likes, okay? If you haven't dropped the like button, drop the like, and when we hit 210 likes, we'll dive in and we'll, we'll fight this big boy battle. Fifty shades of green. Gone. I I need to see them likes coming in. I need to see them likes. Otherwise, it's over. I'm all for and I'm, I'm ending the stream. I'm sorry, but they be the rules. I don't make them. I don't make them. Uh, hey, Jackie, the RTS mod is broken. Are you... Oh, my God. Is this just going to be a problem? Okay. Seems like the battles are fucked right now. For whatever reason. Bit weird. It's like a load problem. Uh, let's go back a save or two. Because it was fine. Maybe, uh, kind of be a memory leak because we're, we're playing. Hmm. Interesting. Um, this is why I don't do long series on mods like this, because they are quite unstable. Uh, let's go back. Let's try this one. What version are you on? 1.7.1. Uh, so serve as a soldier, you need the November 22nd update. Yeah, the serve as a soldier, you need the November 22nd update. Uh, wait, what? How How did... Uh, what? How did this happen? Renly. How? I think I have to go all the way back. A long period of time. Just don't run into the enemy. You did do it last time. Uh, yeah, you get one point. Please don't dive into that enemy army, army again. Uh, yeah, uh, RTS camera you can get from... Um, RTS Camry you get from Realistic Battle Mod. It's in the optional mod files. Again, check out 1.6 point. Sorry, check out my top 5 mod video.
I don't really know. I don't really know why the uh, the battles are doing this, but we will uh, we will per we will continue to to push on and hope for the best. There you go, Bron. Spare boots as well. They're all Bron-esque boots. Is there a, yeah, so you, you need to go on the realistic battle mod and you'll find RTS camera event. Again, check out my uh, check out my most recent top five mod video and I, I detail how to get it to work. Why right, Sander and Bron so skinny? Uh, you did ask the wrong person. Yeah, so annoyingly, we're not even like the higher tier. We're still our tier, but. Oh, <laughs> we just run away from Mace Tyrell and his army. Oh my god, what are you doing, Renly? You fool of a Turk. Well. I guess we, uh, I guess we hold the line. I was hoping we'd get like a good map, but this is an awful map for us. And we can maybe defend the Brit uh, mountains, I guess. Yeah, we are outnumbered like so many soldiers. Wait, I didn't, uh, I didn't command anyone. We're actually not outnumbered by that much. Obviously, we have reinforcements. Wait, so retreat quick and redo it so we can command. If I command something, maybe we have a chance. Oh, I meant. <laughs> I was like, oh, they only have like twelve hundred men. Maybe there's a chance, and I realised they have two thousand. Well, we'll try and take down as many as possible. Yeah, I guess we're commanding the archers. You're already in loose. Yeah, ideally, I want to be, like, back here, you know? Firing in. They, they, have four, they have 300 cavalry, bro. There is no way, sorry. There is no way we stand a chance. They have 300 cavalry. We are going to get absolutely demolished. Okay, yeah. I mean, this is where we hold, right? We have protection from the cavalry, I guess. And we're like in between two mountain sides, so when the cavalry does come. If you win, you'll donate $20. There's no way we win, my friend. So I think you've got a very safe bet there. And I want to probably hold my ammunition as well. It's a whole fire for now. Like, if I come on over the entire battle, maybe there's a chance. It's a slim one, but maybe we could kill enough of them when we try and retreat back to their reserves. And we can nullify their cavalry enough. Move. Well, you guys are getting to loose Line as well. Formation. Soldiers. Loose formation. But yeah, that cavalry is going to rip me apart when it charges in. I can guarantee you that. Well, I just killed Loros Tyrell, so is that. The small victories, eh? How to play serve as a soldier? You need the, uh, like, the older version. But I think it's November something version. Uh, I think it's November 22nd. That works to 1.7.
There's another hero killed. Oh my god, do they just... Sorry, is all the, uh, is all their generals just horse archers? They must be. I just killed Garland Tyrell as well. I'm pressing L and I mean, I mean, you must not have RTS camera installed properly or installed. You should be able to press L and you get this screen and you can change the slow-mo factor and configure keys. Uh, yeah, playing on battle, playing on 1.7.1. .1. Again, guys, if you're looking for RTS camera or serve as a soldier, check out my top five mod video. I explain in that video how to get all of them to work. We'll start returning fire now. Why not? And it's just we just don't have any like as much ammunition as everybody else. So I want to be a little bit careful. Where is, where is Bannerlord coming to console? Uh, it's not something I know, my friend, unfortunately. It'd be dope, though, if uh, Tailworlds did tell me that stuff, you know? Tell me, like, mega high-level marketing stuff. Just like, yo, Jackie, you know what? <laughs> Fuck yeah, look at all that cavalry. There is so much. Okay, well, I just got one shot. And now I am on... At least I still got archers, though. Oh my god, this person's bow skill sucks. Give him out, boys. Yeah, my archers are a whole five. I want them to get closer, really, before shooting back. But we're not going to get any kills here. Like, what are we shooting into? Cavalry? You know, like... Can we get on this horse? Like, what are we killing right now, you know? I guess some stuff, but... I'd rather save my arrows for a bit. Like, some of our infantry are already running as well. Like, yeah, we're just gonna get massacred. They have, they have literally 200 more cavalry than us. Uh, do you have a mod list of the mods you're using? Uh, if you go back to the beginning of the stream, you can see it there. I'm pretty sure I show it off there. Yeah, I mean, like, what do? What do? I mean, I guess kill as many as you guys can. Better that than, than not. Ouch. Ah, this weapon is too short. Oh my god, this weapon is way too short. What an absolute massacre. We should form a shield wall, honestly. Like, we're just getting hit by cavalry, so let's just form a shield wall, get tight. And maybe we can kill some more horses that way. But again, it doesn't matter. They have so many horses. And we're getting hit by missiles now as well. Yeah, go back to the thing loose. Yeah, they have 500 infantry. We have 100. It is literally over Anakin. A sad day for only Baratheon, but now maybe it's the time to go beyond the wall. Maybe now we uh, we take our leave. I say that though, but I do really want to go ahead and get landed before we do that.
But okay, well, we're out of ammunition now, which is not good. And you can see like a lot of our units are also running out of ammo now as well. Okay, now we form shield wall and we just try and stay alive, I guess. But yeah, there's just no hope. Look at all them arrows. It's like that scene from uh, the King, uh, from uh, the Last Kingdom. Like we've run out of arrows on a lot of our crossbows and stuff, so. Give them hell, boys. <laughs> Let your arrows fly. Is there a shield anywhere? Holy crap! I mean, it's gonna be a light shower today. Okay, well, this must be like what the 300 felt like. Reform! Gotta imagine how heavy your shield would be right now. They're running, but cowards! You brave men, stood with Renly to the very end. Me and one guy left. No, I died. Because I'm cowards. Scum. I didn't even kill anyone as well. Am I sure I want to retreat? I mean, the battle's over, is it not? We have no one left, but he's dead. Well, that was a that was an interesting battle to say the least. Uh, we are now free, though, at least, so we can go back to the reach. No, oh, sorry, go back to uh, Storm's End. We have so much money in our in our bankroll as well. Just a bunch of recruits. I mean, I guess we have so much money that we can actually build up a bit of a force now as well. Uh, session though, why don't you lead your army on your own? Because I'm using serve as a soldier. Um, and we're so close to just being independent that we might as well just wait. Like, Renly's going to give us a castle soon enough. So, might as well just sit around and wait for it. How's our inventory? We've got so much wine. Jesus. Why was I just sell all this wine right now? Yeah, we're at 27k. I'll take it. Uh, any good armor? I could buy that now. Uh, any good weapons? Not really. A Lannister sword. There is Valerian steel in this mod as well, so. Uh, John Sneers. <laughs> John Sneers. A bear's pelt. To I me, mean, it's very Game of Thronesy. 
Daenerys' boots. I'm not really a Northman, but... Where's Stannis' cloak? I mean, Stannis' cloak looks a bit broken. I'm not going to lie. That makes us look quite intimidating. We'll, do, we'll rock with that. Hey, how's it going, Alice? Welcome, dude. Yeah, I mean, we need like 5k more experience, which will come pretty quickly. We just need to wait for the Stannis to, uh, to give it to us. And we'll buy another workshop in King's Land in, uh, here as well. Isn't this, like, isn't he the leader of the, uh, Martells? Oh, what am I doing? Workshops. We can't buy this one? Oh, I'm at my maximum. Okay. Oh, uh, well, let's just wait for uh, Randy to come back then. He's currently wounded, right? Yeah, he's currently last seen in Tumbleton today. Is he in prison? We can maybe go break him free. Let's go try and break uh, Randy out of prison. Is he still here? Uh... Drive our way in dungeon. Yeah, let's go break Renly out of prison. Okay. We need to make sure that we have um, the right equipment. Okay. How much of this stuff can I wear normally? Again, I don't really feel like we shouldn't be able to wear any. We should be able to wear all of this, but let's see. Wear our boots, and that's it. Fuck. I was hoping I'd be able to wield like this equipment or something, but I guess not. Okay. We will break Renly out of prison, but first things first, let's get ourselves a good, some good equipment. Yeah, I want to be able to wear it. Who has some Dothraki armor running like this? <laughs> okay, some gold cloak boots. We'll take that. We need like a good chest piece. Gambersons, maybe. A Ben's cloak. It's dope. Yeah, it might be the Gambersons, honestly. Yeah, okay. Can't really wear much. Just the infantryman Gamberson, I think, is going to be our best bet. Dothraki, I mean, actually, honestly, Dothraki armor is probably the best. But it's not going to matter. We're going to get two here regardless, so... Okay, whatever. Um, yeah, we'll just do that. And then weapons and narrow sword is the most expensive. I kind of like the idea of having like a uh, an axe, but isn't that there's any axes we can take? Yeah, we'll just take the narrow short sword. Obviously, we'll keep the hammer. Can't take a shield. It's so silly you can't take a shield. We'll take some... Daggers, I guess. Well, I should be able to wield anything I want to. Okay. I guess this is us. Ton of daggers and a sword. Got boots. Any gloves we can wear? Dothraki braces. No helmets. Wait, da Daenerys' hair. This is actually perfect for a prison break. I think I'm a nice, young, attractive, cute girl, and they'll let me in. Uh, and we have a, yeah, we'll take a scarf as well. Oh, hello. I'm Daenerys Targaryen, and I'm here to see Renly Baratheon for no reason whatsoever. Uh, Jackie, do you want Dale to be super pog? Do you want Dale to become the pigeon cult? <laughs> I have no idea what you're talking about, pigeon, but sure. Say before we move in. Yeah, not a bad idea. Uh, yeah, I mean, they haven't got any plans to release it on console. I imagine the console version of this game will come out 
probably, uh, probably, um, uh, yeah, the console version of this game will probably come out, um, like half a year, a year after launch, I would imagine. Okay, let's go. Oh, hello! I'm Daenerys Targaryen, nothing to see here whatsoever. Okay, where are we trying to get to? We should be able to look like we should be able to stage a, a revolt, you know, like. Nobody tell him it's Assassin's Creed. Oh my god. Okay, that was hardly fair. Also, my sword is probably better because it's shorter, so isn't it caught up? I was like trying to get through my uh, my daggers, and I just rushed you. So like throwing, I may only do fourteen damage as well. So the two v one is going to be difficult, I think. Oh God! Me. Okay, these daggers bloody slap. Okay, we're redoing that. But them daggers absolutely mints. That's the perfect weapon to use in a prison break. <laughs> also, look at us. <laughs> Mum said I could play the Xbox. Yeah, no, a lot of people are asking about the console version of this game today for some reason. No idea why. Well, obviously because I wanted to come to the console, but okay, I did not realize daggers did that much damage. Uh, stage prison break. Can we just like break out. Every we should be able to break out everybody, you know. Like Im imagine breaking Renly out of prison and then not like not breaking anyone else out. God damn it, it takes so long to like change this over. Like when you throw a dagger to get another one out and then throw it, it takes so long. Oh my god, well we're dead. Yeah, that's we we just can't throw the daggers. It just it messes up too much. Like to get another dagger out, it just takes too long. You think you'd probably have one in either hand, right? Okay, we'll we'll just play basically blitz and we'll just stab him to death. It's all good. How many hours do I have on Warband? Uh, like five hundred, maybe. Not that many, at all. Uh, you have to use a sword. No. The daggers are actually way better, I think. I just can't throw them. Like, throwing them is what's taking... Because it takes too long to get the weapon out. Oh, oh, oh. Wait, 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 Randy, come back. Sorry, I need to... I need to ban the bots quick. Renly! Stop charging into battle, you fool! Sorry, what? Why am I only doing... Why am I not doing any damage to him? I'm doing four damage to him. What? Okay, we'll go sword. Sorry. Okay, this is going to be impossible. I don't really feel like we're going to be able to do this 2v1. Fuck's sake. Okay, that time again was not my fault. That was not my fault again because the daggers only did four damage, whereas before they were doing 20. Like, what's up with that, eh? They weren't weak previously. They were fine. They were doing 25 damage. I could swing them way faster than they could swing their swords. 
Don't worry, this time. This time, we're going to do it. There we go. One down. Oh no, I've got blood all in my hair. It's going to take ages to come out. So why is Renly wielding a mallet as well? Yeah, Renly, pick up a sword. No! Fuck's sake, Renly! Ah, oh, god damn it. How is this so hard? How can I not just beat a couple people? If only I could wear my full mail into here. I guess it makes sense. Like, you've been disarmed to speak to the prisoner, but let me fight my way in and fight my way out. And you're telling me I can, I can conceal this sword, but I can't conceal another sword. I could just also just not be bad and just break him out. It's these throwing daggers, man. Instruct him to stay back back. I think I kind of need him for that 2v1. Buy better armor? This is the best armor you can take in. All the other armor is unusable, unfortunately. Good job. Maybe in this one we take his weapon, because his weapon would be way better than ours. Yeah, maybe now we take this weapon. But I'm like one hit again. Okay, 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 come, 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 come. No, come here. Uh, maybe having him here is not a bad idea. I'm going to aggro them and run down the stairs. Oh, wait! Oh my god. Fuck's sake, Renly! Why are you doing that? I told you to stay! Ugh. Stupid. Can't use maces? Uh, maybe. Maces would be a great idea. But they didn't have any at this place. Yeah, maybe there'd be a more efficient weapon. We just need something that just swings fast. Yeah, maybe just like a basic hatchet would be good. A scythe. Scythe would be kind of hard. Like, why can't I, like, how, how can I hide a scythe in, but I can't hide anything else, you know? No, you can't bring maces in. Dragonfire would be dope. Maybe like a hatchet as well. I think a hatchet could be quite good because it's just fast. You can bring in a hatchet, but you can't bring in an axe. Like, cool. Anyway, this time, easy. But like, the thing is here, I can't swing this, but maybe I can bait him in. I can't even wield this one. Yeah, this weapon is not good. Maybe the hatchet would be better. He's coming. You 
That weapon does eight damage and doesn't even stagger him. Is that a joke? Okay, last time. Last time, then Renly can rot in prison for like yeah. Like you can't, you can't even equip. Like, why can't you equip the AI armor once it's on as well? You know, like strip them. Yeah, I mean, it literally is just sort. I can't have any companions with me, right? So, oh, Sand isn't Sandor? I oh, know we got Gregor. There's Hodor. <laughs> Sam Moltali. Lord Varus. <laughs> Hello. Go blunt damage. There's no weapons I can wield. Maybe we can just cheat our way in. Like. I mean, you can wield a lot of swords. Like, I feel like, like, how could you, like, half this stuff you can get and half this stuff, this stuff you can't. Like, why can't I keep bringing my Night King's Blade in, you know? Why not? Maybe the Sledgehammer will do it. I mean, the Sledgehammer is just too big. Your ice. So just equip ice and bring it in. What's it look like? Jeez. That's, it's not even that big. I mean, you can have enough swords. Like, two-handed sword right there. I'm just going to equip this sword. We'll get rid of it uh, afterwards. And the only reason I can bring these swords as well is because, like, the modder hasn't turned them off. Oh, why, friendly? What, <laughs> friendly? Seriously? Now what? Renly Baratheon has died in battle. Great. Well, I'm uh, I'm over you, Renly. You can die, and I will push up, and I'm going to escape myself. Come on, then. Let's be having you. No, Renly died in the prison. It's his own fault. I gave him ample opportunity. This is such an easy one to do as well, because it's just these guards here now. That was such an easy run. Anyone else for me to murder? Oh, it's two more. Fuck. There's Lannisters here as well. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> one more time. Who knew prison breaks were hard? I mean, it's because I've got, like, literal paper armor on. That's why. <laughs> uh, we need to uh, grab the blade again, right? Check armor. Yeah, none of this armor will be... Do we have a harpy's mask? Oh, I'm Daenerys Targaryen, the harpy's mask. <laughs> the Night King has come. There we go. Okay, we have a Night King with the best armor in the game. And a two-handed sword. I will get rid of all of this, by the way. After, uh... I'll get rid of all of this once. Uh, we've just broken Renly out. And I'll use Oathkeeper. These knives can piss off. I'm over these knives. Jesus, Oathkeeper looks massive. Alright. Now, don't be alarmed, Mr. Renly. The Night King hasn't really come for you. I fucking crashed. <laughs> Probably the Night King's armor making it crash. God, this has not been a very eventful... Uh, Couple minutes. 
Can't wear a helmet with the heads. Okay. Funny where we crashed. Yeah, I mean, I get knocked unconscious all the time. Okay. Back to this. Okay, I guess we won't wear uh, a head. I'll just wear the Night King's main body armor. I'm sure we'll be fine. Right. I just need a better sword. Yeah, where's his oath keeper? Oh, I'll just give it back afterwards. Okay. <laughs> hey, how's it going, Reed? Welcome, dude. Uh, yeah, it's going good. Can't complain. No. Okay. Don't you... Renly, get out of my way! Oh, my God. Thank you, Renly. Okay, Renly, just stay here. Let, let me go ahead for now. I mean, I'm almost dead already. Oh my god, I missed. I missed. Oh my god, I missed. Oh my god, my god, see No! Oh god. Okay. Nothing to see here. Nothing to see here. Oh, so how's it going? Uh, how's it going, my man? Welcome, 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 Warlord. How you doing today? Okay, Renly, it'd be great if you could put on this guy's armor or pick up his weapon. Either would be awesome. The bow's not gonna do anything. The bow's gonna get us killed. Cause I can't like I don't have enough time to shoot them. And it's not like Renly can hold. It'd be great if Renny could pick up a bow. Renny, where you at? Okay, Randy, stay here. Oh, I can't climb the stairs when I'm crouching. Perfect. Stairs elude me once more. Is he going to come down? He is. How do you know I was there? I didn't actually realize... Oh, God, he's coming. I didn't actually realize that the Battle Lord AI actually, uh, actually, like, went on patrol. Yeah, yeah, I know he's in the, in the chat. He pops in all the time when we're playing. Can we just escape out of this door? That'd be great. Yeah, it's kind of weird the AI like patrols, but only when you get close to them. Like, oh, I'm here. Where are they? Oh god. No! No! Oh, thank God. Okay, now I just need to go get Renly. All it took was to wear the best armor in the game, and it was easy. Follow me, Renly.
And let's escape. I mean, don't don't mind us. We're just going like out the gate. Uh, you emerge into the streets. No one is here aware of what has happened. My friend. Thank you. I will. So now, should we just go and like join Renly? Like we are clan rank two. Oh, we're very close to clan rank two. Should we just first try? Oh yeah, we need to get rid of the armor now as well. Should we just like join Renly? Like as a, as a landed vassal? Or as a vassal without going through... Uh, um... Without going through the trials. Like, we'll have to buy our equipment, but who cares? What happened to my armor? Oh, it's here. Is that, that's not even our... What happened to... Oh, yeah, we don't have our two-handed sword. Let's have this armor, though, which is nice. Like, should we just, like, join him? We need boots as well. How did I break your immersion, Monty? No way I broke your immersion. Dying and reloading like five times. I don't see how that's possibly breaking your immersion. <laughs> hey, how's it going, pro gamer? Uh, quite a bit, honestly. We have uh, leveled up pretty uh, drastically. We've got plenty of money in the bank. Yeah, I think maybe now is the time. And we can just get we can just like get given a settlement when we take one. I think now is the time we join Renly. Because we can have a decent amount of soldiers. Uh, God damn it. We've been crashing so much today. We didn't crash at all last uh, last week. Or barely at all. If it <laughs> If we, if we, if Renly isn't saved, which I doubt he is, and we have to do that all over again, I'm going to cry. I didn't load at all. I don't know. What, that was first time, Monty. I don't know what you're talking about, mate. <laughs> but you, you have to level to two, but I need one experience, right? So it's fine. And nice. It didn't, it didn't, it did load. Jump ship for the Lannisters. I mean, we're stuck with Renly. This is definitely a Renly playthrough, I think. Oh, we don't have to do that. We can just send him a message as well, which is nice. We can't send him a message? Why not? Yeah, what we need to do is literally fight like one battle and we can start leveling up our boys. But yeah, I mean, we can go and get them uh, them soldiers as well, which is nice. Like, we don't have to, like, just because we're part of these guys doesn't mean that's it. Um, yeah, we'll recruit. And yeah, look at that. The nice thing is that everybody here loves me, so we can recruit quite nicely. We have our workshops here. Is Renly in here? No, he's not. Who the hell are you guys? Renly is last thing at Storm's End. Did I just miss him? Some loot is here as well. Surrender or die, scum. We'll kill these guys and then we'll move on. You know how I said I'm stuck with Renly? Yeah, we are stuck with him this day. Uh, advance. We're going to get ourselves a good old uh, two-handed sword. We need some boots as well. Stop. Look at that. We took 15 damage. They threw a rock at me, and I took 15 damage. Bannerlord, please sort that shit out. I took 15 damage when someone threw a rock at me. Maybe if it hit me in the face or something, but come on. Or you know what we do is we then just join Stannis and we just start again at tier one on Stannis. <laughs> oh, 
Nice, this is 15 kills, next clan rank, perfect. All you guys are my prisoners, all these guys leveled up, perfect. Oh, we actually need food as well now. I forgot, now that we're actually our own party, we actually need to buy some stuff. And sell this crap. Not that we really need money, we make plenty of cash, but... Yeah, we actually need like butter and food. Probably not 600 though. Like, I don't know, like 30 and 60. Uh, well, actually, what we should probably do is buy a bit of everything. Just so we get our stewardship up. And we'll buy some horses as well. Yeah, that's, we're missing something, right? We're missing beer. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Is that eight or is it nine? I can never remember. A bunch of horses. Okay. Oh, I mean, yeah, we need our heroes. I need some boots as well. What am I doing? Can't go around the Seven Kingdoms without boots on. Cool. And we also need a two-handed sword if they have one. Uh, we'll just take one saber for now. Uh, no, we have the hammer, I guess. We'll just take a spear. Uh, one of your actual katanas was delivered? Hell yeah, man. Make sure you post a picture in the Discord. I'd be interested to see what it looks like. Okay, now we just need to find Renly. He's like, he's free. I just don't know where he is. Oh, we also need to make sure that I'm the quartermaster, so we're leveling up. Yeah, oh, I am a quartermaster. Nice. Cool. Could go get some Kingsguard as well. I like have a couple Kingsguard in the army. Could be kind of fun. The annoying thing is, and there you go. I oh, know it's a different clan. The annoying thing is, we have to. Um, King's Landing is once again in revolt. <laughs> yeah, and then. Yeah, it's just gold. Oh, Golden Cloaks do upgrade into King's Guard. Nice. Cool. Got a couple of those. Any good weapons? Oh, you can get Oath Keeper here or a Broad Two Hand. Should just buy Oath Keeper. Not a bad weapon. What armors do you have? I want to buy some Kingsguard equipment as well. 26k though. We actually don't have that much. But we don't have unlimited money. Hey, son of a sloop. Welcome, dude. Thank you so much for the five pounds. You can join a different lord of the same tire uh, because of high relations with the same faction. Oh, what, yeah, you mean we've served as a soldier? Yeah, 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 yeah. But we're actually going to just join as a, as a vassal. I don't really... I, I think it's going to take too long for us to get to 2,000 experience. Uh, sorry, 20,000 experience to get landy because 20,000, right? So I think we're just going to join as a as a as as you would in vanilla. I think that's going to be the plan. Thank you so much for five pounds, man. I really appreciate that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I, uh, yeah, I really appreciate that, dude. Thank you. Uh, cool. Could buy a sick ass helmet. <laughs> Probably gonna pull that stuff quite yet. Do they also give up? Yeah, they are also king guard. Yeah, I mean our army is very weak. We need we need to of course level it up. Um let's also see quite quickly in if uh if our companions are here as well. Oh, there's Renly. Perfect. Hello, Renly. I would like to join you as a vassal. Enter your service. Um, I will be yours. I am ready, Renly Balafrian. You are the one true king. Blah, -de blah, blah. And we crash. <laughs> God damn it, these crashes. They're going to be the end of us. 
It's going to be the end of us. Jackie, what mod did you use to be able to get all the items, i.e. armor? So that's the main mod, that is Realm of Thrones. <laughs> we are cursed, it would seem. If worse comes to worse, we'll just get an army of like 100 soldiers and go north beyond the war and fight whites. Our watch will begin. The game, the game is decided against friendly. <laughs> Literally. Okay, where's he at now? Let's just, let's just TP to him. I should be able to send him a message, but I guess he's not out. Oh, he's there. Doing his usual routes. I'll surge up a save here as well. Yeah, maybe we should go join Stannis Baratheon instead. Oh my god, Renly. How are you so much faster than me? This is a joke. Okay. Um, and your service, fight for a sum. Oh, I just said sum. No, I want to fight as a, I want to be more. Yeah, it's our contract. Cool. Boom. Nice. We get some soldiers. Not many, but some, I guess. And we get a sledgehammer. I mean, the sledgehammer is quite cool. What was longer? They're the same. I'd, yeah, I mean, I guess this matter. We could give uh, the weapons to someone else as well. Okay, boom, boom, boom. Okay, so we're now under Renly's command. We are at war. I mean, actually, see people's troop strengths as well now, which is cool. So we're at war. Oh my god, the reach of so many men. <laughs> okay, but Westerlands actually don't have that many soldiers. Two armies on the go. There's no factions. We should make a faction for succession. Uh, okay, cool. Cool. Uh, okay, let's build up our army. So how many soldiers can we have? We have 99. Perfect. Our charm went up as well. Okay, we need some men. So annoyingly, we we don't get all the free men, like in the castle and stuff, but it's fine. My soldiers should be leveling up quite nicely. Good tiers here as well. Uh, Jackie, get a one-handed weapon. Uh, that way you will not die as much. Uh, I mean, I'm sure I will. Uh, yeah, I mean, I don't have any problems using it. Or oh, some, some pretty nice uh, Stormland soldiers here. Uh, yeah, I have diplomacy working. I, I, I can't remember what version I downloaded, though, so that's the only problem. I can't remember what version I'm using. Like, maybe I'm downloading a different, like, an older version. But I've got diplomacy on, so it does work in some way. Okay, let's go join Samuel Tarly's army. Or, sorry, Darth's army. Actually, probably raiding a village wouldn't be a bad idea. Like, maybe raiding this would be actually a good idea. Because that'd be a good way to level up our army. Yeah, there's only 14 of them, but it's still 14 more. Oh yeah, the two-handed is, is the dream. You just go around swinging. You just start blasting. Oh, we also need to sort our banner out as well. We take so much damage with this game sometimes. It's so stupid. 
it. My god, my throwing is so bad. Oh, god, I'm not sure it is. Hey, how's it going, Lego? Welcome. Uh, not as many level ups as I would like, to be honest. I guess five is better than nothing. Uh, yeah, we'll go boom, boom, boom. Maybe another archer. I mean, realistically, we should just let them all level up. Um, I don't want any of that. We have to leave now immediately because they're coming to get me. Oh, they're sieging us at Griffin's Rest. Okay, back with uh, Griffin's Roost. Let's also uh, change our... Oh, did not mean to click that one. Let's give ourselves a banner of some sort as well. Um... Banners would be in, I think Trials of the Seven have a pretty good banner section on their Discord. Find it in my list. Where is it? It's not that far. It's towards the top of my list. There it is. Pretty sure they have a banner section of their Discord. I can just steal a banner from there. Maybe not. They definitely do. Maybe I'm just stupid and can't see it. I think I'm just stupid and can't see it. The swarm they had one. I think I'm just stupid. Maybe they got rid of it. I don't know. Anyway, let's just go on my Discord. There's plenty of banners there. We have a banner section if anyone's interested. Where's Panther's banner? Perfectly symmetrical banner. We are the withering rose after all. I'm just scrolling up. It was a long time ago. There it is. Cool. Found it. Cool. Actual banner now. Yeah, we'll check the range for the, the thing you guys say. Yeah, yeah, we'll do that. So if we're all with Tywin now as well. Okay, well we can be us a small army. I wanna go check um I wanna go check to see if my companions are here. Yeah. Sounds all perfect. We are still oh bronze there as well. Wait, is, did Bron leave me? I swear we have Bron. Oh, I just paid him fifty four grand to join me. Oops. Whatever. Uh, it's, uh, so banner pace is now part of the persistent flag, the persistent color mod. I'll just sort them out as well. Yeah, good. Can't believe I just spent five grand on getting bond. 
to join me. Uh, so I'll be the quartermaster. Bron can be our scout. Daenerys, our surgeon. And I guess Sandor, our engineer? For now, I guess. I mean, who needs money when we're just going to win battle after battle, you know? Hey, welcome back, Robin. Welcome. Um, right, Sandor, I think, is on horseback, right? Okay, cool. Soldiers! So we still need to be careful, but Lannisters are still fierce warriors, but we can be a little bit more risque. Or just let the AI like really push up as well first. Thousand man battles rarely happen, you think? I'm in a thousand man battle right now as we as we speak. <laughs> I think thousand man battles are pretty common. Why are they going over there? Either way, we'll get my MG luck here. Yeah, we'll let them take the brunt. And then we'll push up. Jesus. Are we already so wounded as well? We have like no shield, so I really need the AI to like take the assault from her archers. And then we come in and clean up. So let's get into a scheme formation as well. Because until we get better units, like we're in a, a tricky spot. So good, we could just break down a tree mid battle. Is the AI just stupid? Like, just charge. Get yourself stuck in. Yeah, I definitely do not have a weapon for this type of combat. I'm almost dead. I am dead. Okay. Well, at least we now have a better, better weapon for mounted combat. Yeah, Sandal's pike is actually really good. It's annoying the AI isn't just charging. Like we have clearly have the numbers advantage. And they insist on just like juking it out. Whereas they could just end this battle if they just charged. Okay, Sandor's uh, uh, spear is only good when we're charging, like, full pal into the enemy. Like, all it takes is the AI to just charge, and they're fine. Archers there as well. God, that guy not dead! Okay, oh, they're charging now. Perfect. Get your asses up there. 
I'll just go there. Hello, my boys could go over in time. Jesus, they're taking a long time. Wait, are we losing? Oh my god, we're losing. Oh my god, are my boys are in shield when I wonder? Okay, my bad, my bad. Don't worry, it helps on the way with my crappy soldiers. Let's get into scaling as well. Let's just hope we have the morale. Which I think we will. I think we still got this. Oh god. Don't worry, just like the Lannisters, I come in right at the end and clear up. And when I get all the loot, the dream, exactly how you should play every battle. I missed. There's Bron of the Black Water. Good job. That's one less army to worry about. And hopefully we, hopefully I capture Tywin as well. I could really do it for money after paying 50 grand for Bron. That should be it, I think. Nice. Yeah, I mean, we didn't lose many men. We lost four soldiers from our party. We got 18 level ups. I'll take it. Okay, you're my prisoner. Yeah, I know what level ups is nice. Let's say I should probably not like level them up in one big go. It's like a nice little tip you can do. Like if you, if you have a lot of one soldier, just don't level them up and they get more kills. Oh, we could probably upgrade some people as well with some better equipment. A ripped Lannister cape. Sure, that's nice and red for you. I actually do need a, a pike I can wield on horseback. I can't actually wield that on horseback. Take the food. Take the cheese, the fish. Uh, take the horses, of course. Don't we need anything more? Maybe she can have a lance. In case she gets like charged by cavalry. Better arrows. A hog as well, why not? Uh, I mean, to be fair, actually, I should have taken it. Save failed. Oh, no, it's not good. We took another one here. Renny Baratheon has died in battle, and now we can no longer save. So... Can I get given, like, the, the headship? No! Vote for me! Don't vote for this loser! Well, Renny Baratheon is dead. So there's that. And now this loser is taking control. I don't even know who you are. Well, we got a new king. Not me, though. 
He is a, a, not a Baratheon, but is a Baratheon. The king is dead. Long live the king. Vote for Dale. That's who I would have voted for. Oh, there's tons of high tiers here. Okay, we're definitely going to take all the high tiers. Not that we actually have that much money to do. Uh, yeah, we're just going to level everybody up as well. I think I need the shields. Uh, we are over our limit, aren't we? Yeah, let's get rid of some uh, levies. Renly is dead. Yeah, flee the high garden. Unfortunately, we are uh, we are the ones who have given our our oath to protect these guys. Try and go join the uh, the Tarvian army, which is moving north. For whatever reason. I guess gonna go take Maiden Pool. Oh shit! Someone just jumped me. I was not paying attention. Uh, yeah, take. Yeah, I don't want to attack you. That's all my money now. We're making money though, for whatever reason. Our workshop's making us tons of cash. Good. And now we're at peace with them anyway. Cool. Now we're going to go Siege King's Landing. I don't know if I can even get involved if they do Siege this. Okay, cool. I don't even know what Game of Thrones is about. I like seeing people fighting. Um, and yeah, you probably enjoy Game of Thrones. That was the dream, Monty, but no one wanted to vote for me. Even though everybody does love me, but I guess because we don't have any settlements, that's probably why they're a little bit funny. At the time, pre-builds were cheaper than making your own PC. Yeah, pre-builds are so expensive now. Like, them companies are cashing in so much on people. Like, they're taking, like, advantage so badly of people. Much like this world is taking advantage of me and my patience with all these crashes. Uh, as well, just a reminder, guys, uh, for those of you who uh, maybe missed it earlier, I won't be streaming on Friday. I'm going to be out all weekend. You guys will have videos Friday, Saturday, Sunday, so don't worry about it. Um, but there will be no stream on Friday. There's actually going to be a lot less streams, unfortunately, coming up because I'm just like so busy with IRL stuff, like on weekends and stuff. The following weekend, I'm going away from my fiance's mum's birthday, and that's a weekend thing. And then the weekend after that, I'm going away again for a friend's wedding. And that's a Friday thing as well. So, like, Fridays are going to be off the cards for a little while, unfortunately. Yeah, maybe we do just join Stannis, you know? Maybe it is the, the true. Maybe the Lord of Light is telling us. Yeah, I mean, you can join the Brotherhood without banners and stuff. Well, the thing is, as well, it's like, you, you can't, like... You can't get a lot of the good graphics cards without buying a pre-build. Like, you can't get a 3080 Ti or whatever. Because there's none in stock on any of the, like, gaming companies who sell them pre-builds have them. Like, again, I'm not knocking it, but those people who did get pre-builds, I'm just saying... Like, the gaming companies charge you such a high premium. But it is, like, one of your only options. Oh, these crashes are going to be the death of me, boys. Just steal one. That is also a very cheap option.
Uh, maybe we'll leave this army. Maybe that'll sort of crash. Yeah, I mean, maybe we just take our, our band of merry warriors and go north beyond the wall. Maybe that's what we have to do. Yeah, I mean, I've got a 2070 Super and it, it does does the job. I've got a 2070 Super and yeah, as I say, it, it's, it's great. No complaints. Yeah, a 2080 Ti will last you for a long time. There was a big old northern army there marching into battle. It's good to see the AI does seem to be like being quite aggressive, so good on them. Uh, you rock a 2070 Super too? Yeah, I mean, I have no complaints. 2070 Super does, does great. I have literally no complaints about it. And like as well, like I'm streaming at 1440p i'm playing at 1440p the game the game runs well and yeah like i, I don't plan on upgrading unless like a, a gaming company wants to sponsor me or someone like sends me a a better graphics card i don't plan on really changing my computer i have a i have a a, a better processor as well um oh, it's hodor <laughs> hodor uh, i have a really good processor uh, where is it? Right here? Maybe? I don't know where it is. I have a... Yeah, I have a much better processor somewhere. Like a generation up from what I have in. I have an 1100 and I think I have a 1200 sitting around that I got sent from Creative Assembly. Just haven't got around to putting it in my PC yet. Right, beyond the wall we go. Beyond the wall we go. Okay, we have 100 brave men. Let's see how much damage we can do. Let's stewardship one up as well. Uh, yeah, possibly. I mean, it's all it's all relative, right? Like some, it's like a bit of both. I think. I think it's like the game crashing and my mods causing conflicts and stuff. You know, it is what it is. 160. I think we can take that. 162 of them. Make sure everybody's upgraded as best as we can. Put on some good archers as best as we can as well. Yeah, crossbows and archers. Boom, boom, boom. Uh, let's make sure we have all our equipment. So, yeah, let's make sure we have Robert Baratheon's uh, Warhammer. Let's give Clegane this Warhammer as well. And just put him on foot. He can need our infantry. Yeah, we'll give him that Warhammer. I need some Cav. Cav's overrated. Oh, God. All right, boys, let's do this. This could be the end of our army as we know it. Oh my god, the desert. You love to see it. <laughs> the glorious desert, the Sahara. <laughs> okay, I mean, the longer we have, the better. Got Daenerys, like, over here. Our cavalry can just roam. And so we'll let Kagane lead our infantry. Our infantry be like here. How good is square nowadays? I wonder if square is going to be the play and just let our archers like fire. We don't have a lot of archers, but just let them like fire in as the enemy wrap around. Obviously, our infantry needs to form shield wall as well. I oh, know, they were in square, weren't they? Yeah. I wonder if square is the, uh, the play. So they have shields and they might be able to do okay. Cavalry, Cavalry comes crashing Forward. in. It's snowing whilst you're in the desert. Yeah, winter has truly come. 
Alright, boys, reform, please. I need actual proper formation. Okay, you guys need to sort yourself out, please. Sort yourself out. Oh my god, there's so many of them. Okay, this is not looking good, I'm not going to lie. Attack! Hold! I mean, the archers are doing great. If I just put an entire army of archers, it'd be fine. That uh, cavalry is so dead. The archers, I mean, my cavalry did pretty good as well. Hold, keep the banners high. Okay, cavalry, run, 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 run away now. Let the archers keep on firing. We've already killed 15 of them. I think maybe shield would have been a better idea. Minus beast can still block though. Yeah, maybe shield wall would have been better. I just kind of like square because then my archers could shoot a bit more effectively. But yeah, I'll definitely try and kill that guy. Yeah, I think shield wall would have been better. I don't really want to break it into shield wall. Because now our archers can't really shoot. So I should go on the other side. The whites in this mod are really well done as well. I really like the, the white walkers in this mod. God, hot girls and boys, get out of the stream. No one likes you. You are neither hot nor a boy. I'm trying to kill white walkers. I just need to wait for my uh, my chat to catch up. Yeah, I mean, the, the amount of these bots I've banned, like straight up lifetime ban, is kind of ridiculous. I'm actually almost dead as well. I need to be careful. Just charge now and shield wall. You guys should be fine. I'll wrap around here. There's one way to level up your skills. Yeah, that's all of them, right? I don't think there's actually any mods being made for uh, the Elder Scrolls. There's other one mod I haven't really seen for Bannerlord. Yeah, there's 24 of them left. I don't know where. There we go. Nice. Oh, yeah. Suck it, whites. 82 level ups from that. Okay, we need more archers for sure. Okay, our army just got a massive upgrade. So we got some bashers and some spearmen. I guess we'll get more bashers. They're probably more of the mace infantry, right? Uh, yeah, crown land. Oh no, crown lands want to go the other way. And whatever. More bowmen, better cavalry. Give a house guard and some bowmen. Nice. All these prisoners. Okay, we'll take the whites back, okay? We'll take the whites back to Castle Black to prove to them that they exist. Got a long way back to Castle Black. They should implement it so that you can't do any damage without Valerian Steel. I mean, that would be pretty broken. The AI would get absolutely demolished. I mean, this seems like a pretty good place to go and train your soldiers up to, like, max rank, honestly. Okay. Only, only 1,100 gold for all them undead. Madness. 
Put it out to this much. We'll get some nice watch in our army. Why not? We buy long claw. We don't have enough for long claw. What if I was to sell a hammer? Probably not. Sell that. Sell that. Sell that. Sell that. Long claw would be cool to have though. Would it be cooler? Yeah, oh my god, long claw is massive as well. It's only 112 in length. Not very girthy either. Oh, why am I bulk of that? Yeah. Cool, 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 cool. Uh, so what's our army looking like now? Out of interest. We've got another Stormlands Men at Arms. We're making another Basher. I get my bashers, upgrade into the crushers, and then that's how you get into the cavalry. Okay. So maybe we do want more spearmen to then make the cavalry. Uh, so we're looking at how many good tiers? Uh, I need to change this around quickly. Uh, so unit... Oh, and tier level. Yeah, I want the highest tiers at the top, so. Cool. So we have a small amount. We have quite a few bashes now. Some decent archers. I want type though. Sorry. So it should be unit type first and then tier, right? Yeah, there we go. So I can see all my infantry and stuff. Yeah, so we're getting there. We have a lot of tier threes that just need to level up. So I think maybe one more battle. Is Sandra Clear getting good? Yeah, I mean, it's pretty decent as companions go. I mean, I never really noticed much of a difference of, like, heroes in Bannerlord compared to an average soldier. I think they need to make it so, like, companions do way more. Like, fighting companions actually, like, mess people up. Because right now, they're like, ah, whatever. They're not really that much of a big deal. Are we going to be in the desert again? Ah, speaking of Arthur Dane. We're in the forest. Okay, this is a little bit more of a, a scary battle, right? The White Walkers charging forward. I have our cavalry here, yeah. Okay, boys, let them come. Archers, not your bows. Shield will hold. Okay, that looks a lot. That looks a lot scarier. F1, F3. <laughs> Got cavalry around the flank. We got our infantry to advance. What is it? F4. But I'm such a pro at this game. Easy, he's wise and had a chance. Cut him down. Let him go. Good job, boys. That was an easy win. Did we even lose anyone? Just one man. Who was it? This basher as well. Of course, it was our high tier units. Um, yeah, I mean, we'll upgrade everybody again. Why not? We have the money. Let's, let's work towards getting some cavalry, I think. Get a brute. Take the food. They don't really need it anyway. Oh, they're actually good mit uh, mittens as well. Nice. Finishes. <laughs> What happens if his one white does kill, kill like, our entire army? Yeah, it killed a man. One white killed a man. An elite archer as well. Of course it did. That's also some bullshit they need to sort out. They need to make it, like, way less likely uh, that you're going to... That you lose soldiers in this. Like, I feel like whenever you auto resolve a battle, it's always your high-tier units that die. Like, always. Like, literally always. Oh, we need to go back and buy some horses quickly from Castle Black so we can level up our cavalry. We like no war horses. But yeah, we'll go like hunt down the Night King as well and 1v1. I think I can 1v1 him quite nicely with a big old mallet. Uh, so let's buy some war horses so we can upgrade. Uh, 
no wars this year. I mean, I guess probably Winterfell has some. Is there a horse place up here? Probably not. Who? Yeah, La, uh, Long Lake has horses. Okay. That way over there. We can also pick up some nice watch whilst we're here as well. I imagine they're pretty good bowmen. Uh, well, so do you get this next month? Yeah, it's on next month on mod DB. Whatever. Whatever one you we want to get. Oh, there's some really high tier Stark units here as well. Sure. And I will also buy all your horses. Not that I have that much money. I'm actually kind of broke. But we'll take a few. I'll spend five grand, sure. Uh, Jackie, you know there's a massive Shogun mod being made? Yeah, Sh Shinjoku, Shinjuku, or yeah. Yeah, of course. I follow I follow mod DB. You underestimate how much I uh I search for mods. I, I check mod DB and uh, oh my god. Oh my god, the Knights Watch are under attack. They are coming. Yeah, they're at war. They're at war with a free folk. They've rallied together. Look at that Tormund. That's a pretty scary army he's leading. Take a look at him. Hello, Torment. Look at him. They have crossed the wall. Um, but yeah, no, I I uh, I check mod DB and uh, Nexus mods daily. Kind of my job to do that. Uh, will I play Evelyn Two on Warbound? I don't know what that mod is, and um, probably not. I don't have any plans to play any Warbound mods. Anytime soon. Uh, oh, there's a bunch more as well. I'll take on these guys again. Dragon Ball. Oh, there's a 300 man group. We got 100, which is fine. Uh, what does the Banner Kings mod do? Uh, I made a video about it. Check out one of my videos uh, on it. Just search on my channel. I'm sure it'll pop up. Um, okay. Is there any high ground? Really? We do want to be kind of far back, though, just so we can utilize our archers. Uh, we want our archers out of the forest. Just clean shots, really. So, like here. I remember you like here. Yeah, we want to make as much distance between us and them as possible. Uh, yeah, I mean, I, I have no plans on. Uh, I have no plans on going back and covering any warband mods anytime soon. Not to say I never will. We went back and played Prophecy of Pendor. I'd never played that before. That was an amazing mod. So, yeah, never say never. But yeah, as I said, I have no plans to go back and play a Warband mod. I mean, these archers are racking up so many kills. Archers and Battle Lord are just too strong. Because of the way the damage is, like, it's because like, it doesn't really matter what you get hit by. You just take a big fat amount of damage. So like I could have like the best armor in the game and an arrow still does as much damage as a rock to me, you know, or as a sword. Like there's a reason why plate armor was so effective, right? Is so that you just wouldn't die to arrows. It's very unlikely that arrows would pierce. Like there was obviously, and that's why crossbows were, in, you know, were uh, mainly used. Oh, we got a companion as well. Uh, if there's any members in chat who want to claim this companion, just, like, just say dibs in chat and you can have this companion. Thirteen. We're getting so much uh, stuff for winning this as well. We're gonna we're gonna come back and we're gonna have such an elite army. It's gonna be amazing. Our army is gonna be like full on elite by the time we get back. I mean, do we do we try that three hundred man group? Yeah, let's do it. Let's try the three hundred man squad. Let's do it. Can we defeat 300? Might be a little bit diff more difficult. We'd level up as well. Nice. Put a point in bigger. Uh, max leadership and I guess max throwing. Oh, there's no members in chat? Yeah, it doesn't look like it. <laughs> Does not look like it. Okay. I mean, there's a lot of them, right? So we need to be a little bit careful. Okay, this battle's actually going to probably take a little bit of skill. When I say skill, I mean... Not really. There's a lot of them. But also, like, we're in Shield War. The White's are stupid. Hey, Josh. There you go. Yeah, give me a name, Josh, and I will... 
name them after you. If I can, actually, I don't know if I even have the correct model that allows me to do it. So you, I might have just baited you and made you type, Josh. What difficulty are you playing on? Uh, the Banner Lord won the hardest difficulty. Uh, so now the archers are shooting, we do need to like charge for a bit. Try and slow them up. Let the archers get as many volleys off as possible. Try and like this, yeah. Try and annoy a few of them. So many of them. Maybe square is like the play now. Yeah, maybe square this time is a good idea. Because there is so many of them. Leave him alone. Oh my god, so much damage. Okay. Alright, boys. Get ready to hold the line. Here they come. The archers need to work like double time. A bit? No, there's no whites attacking the archers. There are some whites attacking the archers. That's not good. There's so many of them. Winter has come. If I win this battle, so will I. My line is breaking hard, though. We need the archers to get closer. Cavalry is all dead. My line is breaking. The square is folding. My men are running. Oh, God. It's not good. You guys need to be in loose formation. What the hell are you guys doing? Fire in! I mean, my army is going to be in tatters after this. We need them to hold for as long as possible. How many of them are left? Got 200 of them so far. Oh no, here they come. Fire! Bring them down! There's still too many of them! Are they running? They might be running. Oh my god, we won. The archers win the day. Of course they do, because archers are OP. So many more archers. That's what I'm talking about. Suck it. Bring him down. Uh, so actually only 11 of our men died. And we got 43 level ups. Which isn't bad. Mass ar I mean, uh, mass archers are OP. Like, this is Bannerlord after all. Ah, uh, yeah. More of those. Like, you can, like, like, get an entire army of Batanian Fens and you will be laughing all the way to the bank. Not bad. Uh, and cool, we actually got some better weapons as well. Some big old axes and stuff. I mean, Clegane has a sledgehammer. I don't mind giving him maybe a double axe. This actually gives him more... Oh, it's donation experience. Okay. Easy. Easy, easy, easy. Uh, so yeah, let, me, let me check that I have the model that allows me to even change the name. <laughs> and then we'll see. I don't know if I have any of them mods on. we got 33 so brave soldiers left. My frying went up though as well, which is nice. My riding. Uh, swift, please. Uh, I don't see if I even have it on. Uh, yeah, no, I don't. I can't rename them. My bad. <laughs> Sorry for getting your hopes up, guys. <laughs> I thought I did. I can always download it for Wednesday. Because I guess we'll continue this on a Wednesday. No reason not to. And I, I now have some characters to give out. Lots of archers. To give out. Uh, cool. Well, what we'll do is we'll, we'll rush back to uh, the Castle Black. I think.
as the, uh, the, the whites go back beyond the wall. Sorry, the uh, dudes go back. We will heal up our soldiers here. And then at the beginning of next stream, we'll go and kill the Night King. And then I guess it's back down here to actually, you know, fighting. And, you know, the, the stuff of mortals. But we have so much influence now, we can actually just raise a battle army and just have pure battles. So next, on Wednesday, when we stream this again, it will just be pure carnage. Uh, battle after battle. Uh, and we have actually a, a, a relatively okay army as well. Um, so it should be pretty fun. And we're almost clan rank free as well. So we have to have even more soldiers. Um, oh, you renamed them that way? Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. No, you can't. Yeah, you can only rename like family members, not clan. I normally have a modem that allows me to do it, but you can't. Um, I already did rename the child. Uh, That's so cool, guys. We're going to wrap things up there. Um... Hopefully you guys enjoyed the stream. Sorry about all the crashes we had. It just is what it is. Um, seems like it's kind of fine now. And when we're uh, when we're commanding the, the soldiers on Wednesday, it should be fine. Uh, tomorrow, I think, will be a Rise of Mordor battle. I already have one recorded. I and mean, then I'm going to work on some really cool uh, battle videos for the rest of the week. Again, Friday, I'm not here. Uh, so no stream, just a video. Um, Saturday, Sunday, normal videos. Monday, next Monday, I might not be here as well. Um, because my, uh, my fiance is in London, so I'll have to be with the dog. Uh, but we might then stream the Tuesday, uh, in the evening. There might be a Bannerlord multiplayer clan versus, 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 versus clan. So we, I might try and join that and get stuck in, uh, which will be fun. Uh, and then hopefully we have some good mods on the horizon. Like, hopefully, um, the, hopefully, 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 uh, Eagle Rising gets their, like, their kind of, their final update together. Um, and, or guess like elephants in, that would be cool. I do want to, I do want to play Banner Kings, oh, sorry, uh, Crusader Blade again. Uh, the mod that allows you to play CK3. And there's some really cool mods for Crusader Blade, uh, that actually like has loads of custom units and stuff, uh, which is cool. Um, so that's definitely something I might check out. Um, yeah, obviously Trials of the Seven is getting a big update soon. I'm looking forward to. They even have like voice acting and stuff. I want to try out the Blood and Smoke mod as well. I think, as I said, that just got a big update. Uh, where is it? Yeah, the Blood and Smoke mod, I believe, just got a big update as well, which could be fun to mess around with. I know Carrier Expanded and Carrier Expanded Kingdoms is also getting a big update, uh, which I'll probably make a video on for this week. So yeah, there's lots of mods in, in, in development. I also do want to try and get a Q&A &A as well going uh, with uh, Macbeth from the King Bardo Lord of the Rings mod. So I might put out a poll if I can confirm that he wants to do it. Uh, I might put out a poll and ask you guys to ask me questions to ask him. Uh, so yeah, there should be lots of exciting stuff coming on the channel. It does seem like Sir Arthur Dane did win the poll as well. 41%, Jamie Lannister with 31 and a young Sebastian Selmy, only 27%. You guys are fools. How is Sebastian Selmy only 27%? Even now, I could cut you, cut, through, cut you through like butter. Is that what he says? Even now, I could cut through you like butter. Even now, I could cut through you like butter. Even now, I could cut through the five of you like carving a cake. Ugh, oh, what a beast. What an absolute beast. Gods. <laughs> and you know he could as well. Even now, I could cut through the five of you like carving a cake. <laughs> beast all right guys thank you so much for watching make sure you go check out my mo most recent videos if you haven't already uh and i'll see you guys uh in the next one uh 